All right, you ready to do this? Yeah, hello. I'm, I'm ready. So, have you seen the tier lists that have been getting made, like, everywhere? Yeah, and the dog... Okay, they're... They're fucking. They are. Yeah. They're. They're fucking out there. Um. So let me. Let me think how we approach this. So obviously, yeah. there's pairings that are really strong. Yeah. Yes. 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 I was also. But individually. Really hard. Yeah. The champions aren't like. It's like really weird, right? Um. Mm -hmm. Like agree. Kindred by herself is not broken, but Kindred yeah, card is broken. Yeah. Well. Right. Yeah. And Nila um, is so dark. Maybe. Mordecai's, it's unbeatable. Right, right. Maybe, maybe we add like a special tier, combo tier, or duo tier. Or, yeah, we can just uh, make uh, unique. Yeah, we can just make new unique. Yeah, as like, like yeah, I think that's word. fine. I think that's fine. So obviously there are Z tier characters in the game. Actually, let, let's start with all the don'ts. Let's just get them completely out of the way. Yeah, I think that's probably the the best way to go about it. Um, so for people that don't realize, obviously the two v two v two v two game mode is actually getting a lot of hype. Um, there's actually starting to be traction for it, even in Korea and China, like forum posts and stuff, Ooh. um, and videos. So I think it's actually going to be a pretty popular game mode. So obviously a, mm -hmm. a lot of people that are playing it, um, because you have zero Q set, you have zero Q times, uh, literally on PB. Um, so this is reminiscent of, of TFT. Um, so that's really agree. cool. So it's really reminiscent of TFT. And the other really big thing about it is it allows high MMR content creators to actually make content cre uh, together, which is very unique because Riot obviously incredible. removed Duo Q. Um, yeah, that's literally incredible. Yeah, it, it's super big for like YouTube and like other types of stuff. So obviously the game mode needs to be balanced because in its current iteration, it really does feel like there's some rock, paper, scissors going on. Um, you don't think rock, paper, scissors is good? Uh, not when it's blind pick. You know what I mean? I mean, so, like now, yeah, Riot, Riot has already I mean, stated that they will nerf and balance yeah, things yeah, yeah. before it goes live. For sure, but it isn't like rock paper scissors the whole point? Like, oh yeah, I'm gonna uh, pick um, Azir, and it's really shit if someone gets on top of me. But my duo right. will pick Maokai to get them off. So uh, mm. I, like I'm rock and mm. paper then. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think that's fine. All right, let, let, let's let's get all the don't tier champions out of the way. Yeah. Um, where do you want to start? I mean, let's just go in alphabetical order. Where, uh, where do you want to play Astro yeah. Atrox? I think um, Lethality Atrox scales unbelievably hard because all these like, like Lethality items are just so broken in it. Like they yeah. have such inflated stats. Like it's ridiculous. And he has, I don't know, does he have good scalings? I don't even know Atrox scalings, but he just does so unbelievably much damage. And it's only like he's legit. He's not Rast here because Rast is obviously like just crazy, right. but. I think he's like definitely A, maybe maybe S. I'm not sure because it's really hard to say when you only play against silver players and you haven't played the champion yourself. But I think minimum A, honestly. Really? Okay. So for yeah. for my perspective, um, I ran into Atroxes a lot with Unforgiven um, when we were doing a lot of duos and stuff, and it felt like he can't play against certain comps. Oh yeah, um, I fully agree. There, there's so many. I, I, well, not just like certain comps. Like he's really good versus these like duo melee comps that people are running, right? Yeah, 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 um, exactly. He's really, really, really good against them. Um, mm -hmm. but he loses to all the range comps. He loses to all the trickster comps yeah, like, like Shaco, yeah, yeah. um, Heimerdinger. Yeah, yeah, those um, is just painful. Yeah, 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 yeah. And and he can't. He literally can't do anything against them. So like, yeah. Even with the combo, like, what do you? He's mm -hmm. like so dependent on augments. Um. I would have him lower than A. I, I I think he's probably like B or C if if the players are really high MMR. Um, I, I think there's you know like sure on paper like there's so much things like oh yeah there's no way he's gonna gap close against Zyber Heimer like there's no, right. way. no way. But then in reality you get like an a vanish augment and then he turns invisible and sneaks right. up on you and all of a sudden he's in your ass and then maybe he has like an Alistar duo which like sees you for one second and he gets one passive proc eclipse proc boom and you're dead. So uh, I think it's really like it's really hard and like convoluted to give it a precise rating but i think like we can do somewhere around b and a right we yeah yeah think, like, i think we're pretty, we're pretty much agreeing on a and b um yeah, yeah. i i feel like uh i don't know i think think about it, and analytically the higher the skill goes i think the worse he's gonna get yeah that's for sure um yeah all right uh okay ari i don't I really feel think it. she's that strong like, i think she's really yeah, bad uh, i i can't yeah. think of a pairing with her that's like good i can't think why you would play her um yeah. over mages um, I can't even think of like an augment that makes her magically good. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. I'm just, I'm fine to just put her in D. Yeah, yeah, I think I think she's I mean, CD, one of the worst I champions. Think, yeah, yeah, yeah okay. and I guess in relativity to the other champions, pretty shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Akali, I would go maybe C B. Like uh, I don't really think um 
like I think her shroud is like nice, but I also think you can just walk away from it and then like mm. you're fine. <laughs> yeah. What do you think? Yeah, no, I I completely agree yeah, with you. Like, I think that her, her think shroud is so her shroud is okay in mid game. Yeah. Um, but then I think that she encounters problem with itemization when people can start itemizing against her, as we're talking about like mm -hmm. later rounds. Um, and also there's just some maps where she sucks. Like yeah, holy set holy. maps uh, are very yeah. flip yeah. for her. Pike maps can be really problematic for her. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. I, I, I think that she's also like semi map dependent. And again, like what combo goes with the Kali that like you're happy? I, I don't think there is one. And everyone has so high inflated health as well in this mode. And it's not like she does right. any um, like, uh, ma like increased damage towards people who have high health. Right. Like, right, right, right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, Action. I think he's C, maybe. I don't. I have not really seen like him do that much. I just think there's so much better than him. Yep. I think he's okay, but it's just like everything's better. Yep. Uh, Alistar. I think he is S tier. You actually think Wait, so? You, you don't? No, I think he's bad. I think there's what? He, there's so much you can do with him. Like you can. So play, okay. Can... Oh man. Yeah. So okay, you can buy ghost crawlers. You can buy ghost crawlers and stay in walls with your duo until the end of the game, until fire comes and just push everyone out. And you can like guarantee like so many rounds that you're fine until you run to someone who just runs you down like really quickly. Or you can also just go tank and be like immortal. Like, it's it's kind of aug dependent what you need to go. But the thing is because he has so many options, like he can go AP and tank. That no matter what aug mm. you get, you can kind of play around it. I feel like like I think he's I think he's kind of scary. Like late game, he like his AP scan is insane. It's eighty percent on Q. 100% uh, yeah. on W, 80% on yeah. E, and 55% damage reduction. And then on top of that, he gets like healthy as fuck because the items that just give you so much health and he spawns right. with so much health. And he's not like a Kali where it's like, oh yeah, you can't build Leandris. This guy does build okay. Leandris, he does build Demonics, and he's still like, I think he's pretty crazy. I'll be totally uh, honest with you, I don't think I've ever yeah. seen an Alistar get first place. Really? I I've never seen it. I see this. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, I, I've literally never seen it. But okay, okay yeah. so w when I'm, I'm playing, yeah. I'm mostly like tryharding with L LCS LEC players and stuff, yeah. right? Yeah. For the most part, yeah. or like Drew Toot yesterday. Uh, but me yeah. and Drew Toot were sort of like goofing around. Um, I don't know. I've never. I don't think I've ever seen him get first. He's really strong mm -hmm. in mid game, for like yeah. all the reasons that you listed. Yeah. But what does he do against the Z tiers? It, 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 yeah, it is scary. I think super late game. Like, if he's against Kaisa and he can't burst her down, or like he's against like Ka Tarek, uh, Nila, it's like, yeah. Like... Tarek, Nila, Tarek, Kindred. Um... Yeah, but I, I still think he gets like at least top two, like every run if you paired with something good. Oh, I think he gets top what two pretty often. Yeah. I think he gets top two. But does that make him S? I think it makes him like A. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I guess you're right. Yeah. I still think he's very good, though. Okay. Um,. Okay, I mean, I, I'm totally open to, like, having my perspective change. I just haven't seen it. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, I've played now, it myself. Like, That's why I feel like... You've played, like, a shitload of games. I think that I've played, like, yeah. 150 or something, maybe? I don't know. Oh. I don't know exactly where I'm at. I'm really... Yeah. Uh... Because I... So, yeah, no. I, I, I've been, I'm, I'm playing on two accounts, right? Gave me two accounts. And initially, I thought the LP gains were fucked. You know what I mean? Yeah. When I started getting <laughs> plus 36. So yeah. I thought, like, okay, my LP gains are fucked. So then I tried getting on another ID and, like, seeing, yeah. and I'm like, oh, what the fuck is going on, man? Like, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Was it because um, you do acute someone? I don't know. Well, yeah, I mean, I only perma do Well, no, I I, so I tried playing solo, too. But even when yeah, I play solo, I only get 36. What? That's weird. What do you get? I get 32, 36, and that's, like, at the highest high, so... Yeah. yeah, I started getting 36 at 4K. Yeah, it, it scales with the guy who you're doing with, like, whatever he gets, you get. Oh, my God. Okay. Yeah. All right, Amumu. I think, I think, I think he's D. Does. I really yeah, think he's yeah. D. I think everyone um, does his job better. I think even in, even in, like, his combo pairings, it's just so yeah. gimmicky, and then people itemize yeah. against it, and he's useless. I agree. Okay, uh, Anivia. I haven't really seen it pop off, but I, I, I don't know. It's not like it's, like, it can't be too weak, right? Like... You got huge zoning tools, and the map is like so narrow. Some of them, like, uh, and you can zone them off the fruits and everything, and you got stuns. Like, yeah, I don't think it can she be has bad. wall. Right, right, yeah. right. There's some maps where I think she's definitely gonna be broken, and then her passive is very valuable. Oh for yeah, it's time. every round. It's fucking stupid. Right, right, right. Yeah, so her passive amazing. is really valuable. I think there's a lot of good potential augments for her. I think that she's a yeah. solid B, because mm -hmm. the 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 reason that I'm I'm unwilling to put her higher is she has such an item dependency. 
mm -hmm. an augment dependency, but she doesn't get that till mid game. And typically, no matter who you pair her with, she bleeds hit points early. Yeah, but it's, I don't know. I think losing early is so like whatever because you lose like two two health. It's like okay. No, 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 but I mean, I think she chain loses rounds, no? Yeah, I don't know. I think it's a lot how you play around because <clears throat> I think early game, it's especially around the fruit, right? So right, and you can kind of force eat fruit because of your wall. I feel like right. Okay. Uh, really I'm fine to put her B. Yeah, I think so as well. Okay. Uh, Annie. Fucking broken. <laughs> really strong. Unbelievably strong. I've only seen her once. Is she actually oh, that strong? I think minimum S tier, like unironically. Okay. Um, yeah, I did see her once with done. Ivern, and yeah, it was really, really, really gross. Yeah, the Daisy tippers, and they just run. Like, yep. like getting anything that amps your damage, like warm routine, and you will deal yep. like. 5k damage nuke. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. It's almost like, it's like right. Even even if they itemize against it, you can just do really yeah. creative yeah. stuff with like Tibbers, Leandri, Rylies, and mm -hmm. send Tibbers at them early in the round. Yeah, and it's so yeah, nuts. it's very very crazy. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, I, I'm fine to put NES. Uh, Aphilios, mm -hmm. I think he's. I've not seen a single Aphilios. I, have I no idea. think he's just D. I really think he's okay. just D. Yeah, I would have okay. thought he's. Isn't Aphilios really strong with items? Like, can you kind of get your items in this? So. But there's just better ADCs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which is like the problem. Mm -hmm. um, the one thing that he does have is he has his. Uh, well, the the other thing for him is like his guns. I don't know exactly how they work. Like, how does he yeah. run through his guns? Does he have to like I don't prepare know. them I mean, before I don't the round? Yeah, who knows, man. I actually don't. Yeah, so I don't know. I mean, I'm open. I'm open to the Aphilios thing being changed, but for now, yeah, yeah. it's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, I, I um, Ash. I don't know. Whenever I see her, she does so much damage. But yep. like, Same. I don't know. I think she's kind of whatever. She just does. She so gets much run damage over. And like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm fine to put her like C or B. C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, C. Yeah, yeah I think okay. so. C. <laughs> All right, the dragon. Yeah, I think every T list puts this guy so low, but I've played him so many times, and I think he in completely invalidates certain comps. Yep. Like, sure, the comps that gets on top of you, it's rough. But if he plays that shit into, like, a really strong comp, which is, like, high Merzyra, like, you just win. You literally just win. You put your E down, it's a fucking map-sized, because for God knows what reason, you have, like, 200 starters at level 5, yep. and you just win. And I don't know if it's bugged or something, but I feel like your ult range is way bigger than it's supposed to be. And you can literally just, like, stun someone Maps from are just so tiny. Map. Yeah, it's so nuts. Like, anything yep. else that combos into it, you just stun them. It's like yes, crazy. and he's he's actually really powerful even early because people don't yeah. realize how much damage he does when he just gets to hold yeah. Q. Yeah. And you um, get 50 starters in the spawn. Like yes, you spawn it to the doesn't game, like make any run. sense. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> it's not. Like, it's not. like, yes, it does not make any sense. Aurelian Souls and actually very And you can fly over whilst the fruits early, which is like also... Right, 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 right. Yeah, he has, a, he, he has evasion, really high base damage, zone yeah. control, really good scaling with items, and then he has his augments, and it's like, mm -hmm. also, some maps are just like unwinnable against him. Um, yeah, like it's the very strong. Where you it's very, very strong. Through, you put your E down. Yep. Yeah, nice. I got legs. Yep. Okay. Uh, Azir. I, I tried him earlier, and he does so unbelievably much damage, but it is really hard to like actually survive, and I feel like meta yes. is going to be like a lot of assassins because lethality items are so OP. Yep. So I feel like, I don't know, maybe B? Yeah, what I think he's of? like B. I, I, well, <laughs> might actually be lower than B. Okay. He, he really does damage, and you, the thing is, you can do some... Re listen, 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 this will, this will mind me, blow okay, you. Okay, I'll let you cook, I'll let you cook. Okay. You can put three soldiers on, a, on your map, Q towards a plant, and every single soldier will eat a plant. So you got the Giga Munch tech. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Three, yeah, yeah, I yeah, saw yeah. that. You eat three plants instantly. Right. So you can insta eat plants, then get more soldiers, and not only that, your equal cooling gets lower, and if you bump into people, you get another right. soldier. So you get like five soldiers level one, and then you deal like 200 damage. Like, uh, it, it does big damage, but I feel yeah. like it's kind of. It's iffy. Like, it's just really enemy comp dependent. Yeah. If you run to melees, then yeah, you will shit on them but if anything like zed yep. uh, good night yeah yep okay uh brad Ooh. I've i seen haven't the seen him once playing. yeah i mean it's kind of rough on 180 ping like doing anything yeah. but uh he gets so many times per round it gets really, really scary yeah he gets like unbelievable amounts like he has to collect them but there's literally like five per second spawn it's like crazy <laughs> yeah i don't know i have no idea okay uh yeah, I don't know. I'm going to put him in D, just because I, I literally yeah. don't know. Um, Belveth. I think she's so bad, even though she gets so many stacks. Really? I feel like um, she has pretty big damage, but then gets outscaled very hard at the end. 
I so I think so my my reason for Belveth, I think it would make more mm -hmm. sense like later for people watching would be like um she can't I feel like she cannot play against S and Z tiers. Yeah, 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 like into any Aurelian. It's any just... Aurelian, Rost, like it, yeah, there's yeah. just so much. Yeah. What what is she doing? Very hard. Um So for that reason, I mean I, I really feel like she's like she's actually don't. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Um yeah. Okay. Uh Blitzcrank. Terror shit. Yeah, terror shit. True. Thanks. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Brand. Go. I haven't seen him once. Have uh, you? Uh, yeah, he does huge damage. Like, the, the, I think dot champions in this are just crazy. Okay. Like, um, you can just go he in can and also roll some die. really insane augments. Yeah. Um, and then he's perma spamming, and he actually outranges Annie. So yeah. Yeah. there's that value. Um, okay. yeah. I think he can also do some pretty. Uh, he can do some interesting stuff on the map with set. Uh, you yeah. know, he can he can target, he can burn set, and then he can E, mm -hmm. and then it just fucking expands to yeah, the enemy. So yeah, so yeah. that's really broken. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I think Brand's really good. I think he, I think he's actually yeah. like yes. Yeah, I think he's okay. minimum A. Yeah. What are you thinking? No, I think I think he's S. I, I think he's actually okay. S. Okay. Just has a lot of range. Um, yeah. there's I a mean, lot of pairings. Really, like, like, how do you kill him without like losing half your health on anything? Right. 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 Okay. Uh, Broom. I think he's unique. Shit. You don't think so? Yeah. Wait. Well, I don't really? know. I've, I don't think he does anything. Okay. Uh, what right. does he do okay. better? I've than, only like, seen him with combos. Point? I've only seen him with combos. Yeah. Um. So I think that would have been super neat. Wait. Um. Okay. Uh. Caitlin. I think she's underwhelming. I don't think crit scales that hard in this. Uh, how how do you think she's gonna be on eight ping though with all her traps? Yeah, in her net? yeah. Poo. I mean, I think zone you know control I mean? is absolutely gigantic for the plants because the mm -hmm. plants are literally everything, right? Right, right, right. But, and and Caitlyn can auto a lot of the plants from over the walls, mm -hmm. where some range champs can't do that. Yeah, I just feel like she's like doesn't do that much damage. Like, sure, the traps are crazy, and there's mm -hmm. lots of Zanya's builders and stuff, and I feel like there's lots of stasis in this. Um, but at the same time. I don't know how and uh, I don't know how uh, she plays against like Asol. Like you, you just press R and there's no way he right, does. Right, right, like, what is she? Right, right, right. And you and you know you can know if someone has flash or not in this. You just press tab and right. you see it. So well, they, like they get it every other round, round, right? Yeah, yeah, that's true too. You press tab. Yep. Okay. Uh, Camille. I've never seen her. I've truly okay. No so I saw it with Drew two yesterday, and it was yeah. the stupidest thing I ever saw. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It is the uh, so basically he rolled warm up routine in one game and in another oh, game well. he rolled bejeweled gauntlet. Okay. Um, so his abilities <laughs> can crit and yeah. he just warmed up and then he charged true damage on a plant and just went in and that was it. Yeah, that makes sense. So with R and low ping, I think, I think she becomes a champion that you have to rush early. Mm -hmm. Um, and if you don't have some form of like really hard CC or like mm -hmm. something. I think she actually will just nuke you. Okay. Um, I think she's S. Uh, I genuinely think she's S. Really? I feel like every champion can buy Zonyas so easily. And since it re like, there's not a fight where you don't have a Zonyas like on Summoner's Rift. So I feel like later on to the game where people like will definitely itemize it. I think she loses so much power when you get Zonyas. But I don't know if you think so. I just haven't seen it at all. I, I just think like, um, I, like anything. Just gets countered so hard by Zonya's. Uh, like yeah, there's a lot right. of yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'll, uh, okay. I'll, I'll put her down below. I mean, the, 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 the one of the things about Camille, she's really good against the tank comps because of the true damage. Mm. Yeah, there's so many of those. There's a like... lot of those. Um, mm -hmm. she's really, really good against them. She's really good at holding down like some of the unique combos. Um, because obviously Hextech ultimatum. So mm -hmm. yeah, I think she. I, I, yeah, I think she has a lot of value. She, I, 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 I don't know. Maybe I'd have to play it with Drew Toot more, but um. Yeah, yeah, I think she's A. Uh, okay, Cassio. Uh, I haven't really seen her much because of the ping, right? But I think on regular ping, she's going to be insanely strong because she's going to be like strong early. It's not like she's mana gated because you get mana every round, right? And, yep. uh, I, I, she scales really hard. Uh, six items, you don't need shoes. I don't know what happens with shoes, actually. If she just doesn't buy shoes, then what? She just doesn't buy shoes, yeah. I mean, I, I, yeah. I mean, yeah. So okay. basically, you end up getting a, a free legendary by what is it, round five? I think that's the way the math works. Round five, yeah. right? Yeah. Something I think like you get free legendary if you don't buy boots. I mean, there are some champions that don't buy boots, right? They just stay on uh, mm -hmm. one legendary and then they get free items. She's the same exact way. Um, I would put her in unique. 
Um, because okay. I don't understand why you would play her over some of the other yeah, yeah. anti-engage so. mages. But mm -hmm. I think her and Twitch um, oh, and her and sounds... Teemo is yeah. really gross. And her and Sin. Yeah, yeah. I think those good. combos, Cassio is like not balanced. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I, I think in that regard, it's, it's I all think fine. There's so much that, I think what makes champions really strong in this is when there is not much that you need to go right and you're really broken and you're okay mm. if, if it's like nothing goes right in augmented right. terms. Actually, there's so much that she can get that's good. Like the yeah, yeah. Uh, increased like cooldown per cast. Like she gets that, uh, yeah, a nice machine gun, man. Right. Okay, uh, Cho'Gath. I haven't seen him once. I have no idea. Uh, really he has some augments where he, if he gets it, it because so yeah. there there's like some augments that he can. If, if there's like two augments where if he gets both of them, um, yeah. the then he his what his Q goes to like. 1.19 seconds and it yeah. knocks you up for one second you know what oh, i mean dear. yeah so he has that um he has invocation which is really huge because cho'gath can get like up to 9k hp even his ap yeah so invocation is really nuts uh because you can cast it twice per round so you heal 40 yeah. percent max hp um his Q is really long range, very short cooldown right like even if you don't roll the right augments his Q is still like a three second cooldown yeah, it's really um, obnoxious. Yeah, it's very, very obnoxious. If you land um, one, it's just, yeah. If you land one, it. right, exactly, exactly. And then he has a lot of pairings that he goes with. Um, yeah, I can imagine. I think he's probably A. I don't think he's broken. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, 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 I agree. And then he's flexible too. He can go tank, but I think it's really rare. Uh, okay, Corky. I, I think Corky's ridiculous. <laughs> You get uh, yeah, every round after level six. Like it's it's just insane. I don't yeah. know how you're supposed to play around something that has package every round. And you know, yeah. if you get chauffeur with Corky, he can package, do the most craziest suicide bomber shit, and then he teleports yeah. back. I had yep. that. It was so funny. It's just crazy. Yep. I I think Corky is actually a Z tier. Yeah. Well, what build think, would you go on him? The, the, the rock uh, well, no, well, I mean, I think that's the point, right? Is he can he can be really flexible with yeah, his build. Yeah, yeah, that yeah, is yeah, a legit. huge bonus. Everything works. Yeah. Yeah, everything works on Corky. He can really itemize specific to the way that the game is going. Um, you know, like paying attention to who he's facing next, etc. Like seeing who's mm -hmm. getting low and then pivoting yeah. his itemization build. I yeah, think completely. that flexibility and the fact that he shreds armor and MR. Mm -hmm. So he has like a lot of pairings, package, a lot of augments are just broken. The fact that he can mm -hmm. be like poke or he can go AD and like close quarter combat, like it's just too much. I think he's actually just a Z tier champion. You muted. Hello? Val? Yeah, yeah. Alicopter's oh. in my chat right now. He's, he's oh, okay, like, okay, 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 okay. He thinks, he thinks Alistar is better than Aesol, but. Uh, what? Uh, There's <laughs> yeah. no way. There's yeah. no way. Okay. Only AP though he says, not not tank. But okay. uh, yeah, I don't know. Is AP like augmented reliant? I don't. I don't think it's too reliant, is it? Uh, well, <sighs> like I think things can go right, but I don't know how you play AP Alistar into Aurelian Soul. Like, like don't you just get completely rolled in? Like against something that zones you. I don't know how you'd play Alistar into like Heimer, Zyra, A Soul, like these. Right, right, right. There, the there's floor. so many I things I don't, I don't get. Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't I don't know how Alistar is supposed to play it. Like, I'll be able to talk more about that later when we get to some, like, champions that I've been yeah. playing or, like, uh, some of the LCS and LEC players have been playing. Um, yeah. yeah. Uh, Darius. Well, I think he's one of the Ds. You think, think he's, he's one of the Ds? Yeah. yeah. I think have he is, too. Yes, well? yes. I yeah. No, I've, I've seen him so much. There's so yeah. many fucking, like, silver, iron, bronze pairings with him, and <laughs> yeah. he's so bad. Um, I just never see him do well. So, okay. Uh, Diana. Uh, I haven't really seen her much, but I can't really imagine that she's good. No, I, yeah, she's terrible. Like she's absolutely, she's notes, absolutely awful. Sad, right? Yeah, she's absolutely terrible. Yeah. Uh, Mundo. I think he's definitely like a Z tier. I think he's batshit insane. Really? Like, yes, I think I think Mundo is the only champion that can buy health and then not give a fuck about like Leandri's Borg kind of stuff. I think if he gets to his late game dream with hard steel and he gets some stuff that he likes and he gets like 11k health, like his health regen makes it so that you don't give a fuck about like Bork and shit. I think it's like he can go so crazy. Like he can really go crazy. And then there's like the thing is he has got like so many multiplicative scaling things 
because of his health, right? His health gives him AD. I right. think champions like that, with that kind of stat, like, um, like sure, Rise is like an example, right? But he gets like uh, half your manas into health. Yeah, the game right. is over. You got 15k health. Right, or right, like right, with Vlad, right. uh, you get 15% more health and 20% more AP. Yeah, game's over. You just become Thanos. I think that's definitely the case with Mundo as well. Okay. I, I think Mundo can also... Like, there's so much that can go right for him. He gets the crit thing, like, where he can critically resist. Okay, he's going to be fucking Thanos. He gets, like, the evocation. He's going to be Thanos. He gets, like, uh, whatever, the, the restless restoration where you heal per movement. Okay, he's going to be Thanos. Like, the guy can tank literally the burn on the map, like, so easily when he gets, like, I, I think he's just insane. Have you not seen him? I've seen him, but I've beat him a lot. I, I don't know. I mean, yeah. I played him once. Um, I don't think he's... Okay, the only reason that I, I'm being... Like, I, I, I don't yeah. think that he's B or C, right? Um, I was going to have a convo with you about S or A, but then you said Z, and now now, it, yeah. now it's making me think, like, what the fuck's going on? Um, yeah, he's crazy. Did, maybe, maybe okay. F, but he's really hard. Okay, okay. So I feel like... Now, okay, so we already talked about bleeding HP early, and you're saying that it doesn't matter. Um... Mm -hmm. But I think it can matter. Uh, so I think it can matter if you're playing against higher level players. So when the game actually releases and there's proper mm -hmm. MMR, um, yeah. Yeah. I think people paying attention to who you're facing next and like itemizing or like buying potions specifically for that matchup, etc., and min maxing, I think mm -hmm. Mundo comps will bleed so much HP. Okay. Um, that they can't afford to lose. I don't. So I'm not. I'm not disagreeing with the late game uh, fantasy that you're proposing that he does have because I think he does have yeah. it. Um, I just feel like at at two, three, and even four items, if people can itemize, or if there's too mm -hmm. many other sources uh, of like Grievous in in the in the game, like what does he do? Yeah, I mean, I feel like Grievous only goes so far though, and then Mundo just against him, yeah. Mundo and he doesn't care, like. I think he's, he really is crazy, but maybe, maybe not Z, but I for sure think he's S. Okay. Yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah, like, I was, I was, you, I was totally so fine to have the, the SA combo. Yeah. There's also so many things where, like, you kill one person and you can just farm Heartsteel on the second one. Yeah. Or you, you can farm Heartsteel on the set on the map. Yeah. Or you get item haste and you farm Heartsteel like crazy. Like, it's so scary. Yeah. Um, okay, Draven. Uh, I've seen him be okay, but I still think he's just... Terrible. Yeah, I, I think he's in the same exact boat as Caitlyn, I th or like Caitlyn, Actron, yeah. etc. I think that yeah. he needs certain augments. Mm -hmm. um, I think he needs really specific augments, and I think he needs really specific team comps. There's li there's quite literally nothing that he can do against certain pairings and like SA yeah. and like yeah, 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 yeah. Um, So he just loses. Um, yeah. But yeah. Uh, Echo. Uh, I think he's like B tier. I don't think he does anything special. Like yep. stronger than regular, and it's not like he gets. I think like maybe Jewel Gauntlet would be good on him, or like uh, scope weapons. Have you seen? He gets like insane E range. Yeah. But, like, but yeah, if you're praying like, oh, I need to get this gold augment, I need to roll three times, and then later on into the game you get like something terrible. It's like, yeah, mm -hmm. well, nice. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Elise. Uh, I think she's underrated. I've seen I people do too. pop off really hard on her, and yep. I think she's got so many tools. Like, she's strong early, got auto resets, she's got stuns yep. on fruit. So it's really hard to play against her, and I don't think she scales poorly either, because I think what happens on Summoner's Rift that she's weak late game is that she doesn't have economy, but right. economy is just infinite in this one anyway, so right. I think she's not too bad. Uh, where would you put her, B or A? Ooh, I don't know. What do you think? I've only seen her a few times. Um, well, my worry is high ping, because she's going to be really weak yeah. early. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So my worry is high ping, um, and then again, dependent on what other comps are in the game. Like she's not doing anything against Heimer Shaco, like those types of comps, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Um, and if there's too many sources of magic and people can get magic resist, then she's just useless. Mm -hmm. She's not going to mm -hmm. do anything. Like she would need to roll all of the ability haste and then chain cocoons. Okay. I, I mean, that's just what I think. Um, yeah. yeah. I, I think she's like B. I'd say yeah. I, I agree. Okay, uh, Evelyn. I have not seen her once. Yeah, I don't know. I don't. I mean, it's I... very stressful having like invis champions. I feel like because you can be really creative and approach from so many angles. Evelyn, but... lol. Let me. So wait, her her W shreds MR for everyone or just herself? Just herself. I'm pretty sure. No, no, no. It's everyone. It's everyone. Really? It's everyone. Yeah, forty per forty five percent okay, magic bad. resistance reduction. 
That's um, pretty crazy. Expunging a target. Okay. 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 Well, that's kind of nasty. If the target is cursed for at least, so you can start the round and you can charm. And then if you expunge it, they lose 45% MR. So I imagine that she maybe has duos, but it's going to be really gimmicky. Hmm. But then again, her R is like the stupidest thing in the world. Yeah, I mean, if someone's that low, I feel like you just win the game anyways. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Win more. Um, I don't know where I'd put her. Yeah, I don't know either. Maybe C? Or... Yeah, I'll put her C, yeah. Uh, Ezreal. Uh... I don't know. I haven't really seen him because of the ping, probably. I think on low ping, he might be pretty good. Yeah, I think on I low think ping, he's actually probably going to be nuts. Can you imagine, yeah, like, Korean Ezreal's? Yeah, and, you know, you get so much haste in this game mode. Right. Like, for free. Right. And, the, like, CDR shoes, uh, 40 haste, and then, like, you get your man immune early, and it's, you yep. get, like, 100 haste already. Yep. <laughs> like, Dude, I, yeah. I, so I, I did run into an Ezreal that had the, uh, the augment that whenever you use an ability, you get ability haste. Yeah. And he also had True Shot Barrage. Yeah, well. So. That's <laughs> oh and you can go tankiness God. as well to like counter that. Literally like, yeah, unwinnable yeah. on the uh the 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 blue map with like all the the spikes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the fucking snow map, unwinnable. Yeah. Absolutely well, unwinnable. On the play against. Um, I think he's probably S or even I yeah. think he's yeah. actually maybe Z. Because he can go I, AD I or AP? Potentially, yeah, potentially. Yeah, holy shit, that's actually true. He I can go so AD or AP. So right. Like, right, he can also he get Zanya's and it's not grief. Yeah. yeah. So, I think he's going to be a bit of a problem on 8-ping. Mm-hmm. Um, I can see it. He does have a weak early game, though. So, it does, you know, he does have to scale and, and hit augments, but... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, diddle sticks. I'm, I'm curious what you have to say. I do don't know. I mean, he win he wins early rounds because really high base damage. Yeah. Um, the problem I don't think is he bad, is you think? he do he doesn't scale bad at all, but I feel like the problem is with two people, it's really hard to get drain yeah. off. Yeah. Um, and if the people are humans, they save their uh their 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 sweeper? trinket. Yeah, they save yeah. sweeper for like when he could R from a brush, and yeah, then he doesn't yeah. get fear. I think so um, too, but. I also feel like he CCs so unbelievably much. Yeah. Especially if he gets high ability haste and he keeps fearing. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think he's probably like A, because I do think that versus CC heavy comps, he can't he can't play. Mm -hmm. I think so. Okay. Uh, Fiora. Uh, I think she's probably maybe A as well, maybe higher. I don't know. I think she's got like pretty strong early. Um, she has the plant reset, auto reset. I think that's an unbelievably strong mechanic that you yep. can auto reset. Is there a Q hit plants as well? Do you know? Uh, Surely not, right? not sure actually. I I, could, I haven't uh, seen her much. Yeah. yeah. Okay, it doesn't apparently. But yeah, I don't know. I think she's pretty scary. Like okay. And the thing is, she scales so hard, and there's so much that can also go right for her in augments. Right. Yeah. I. Ah, oh, she s. Hmm. Oof, I, I don't know. I haven't really. I think on low ping, I think she's gonna be terrifying. Yeah, I think. Okay, yeah, I'll put. I'll put her. Uh, you can also go like cold breaker and do some spicy stuff, maybe like with Mord or. Right, 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 like, right, 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 right. Yeah, and then she, like I don't know. It's like I, I don't know, like, if you isolate someone and it's a one v one against cold breaker Fiora, <laughs> like you have to be some crazy ass champ to be able to beat that. I mean, I think the only champions that really beat it are yeah. uh, well. Depends what. Well, no. I mean, Ezreal would need to have so much ability haste to keep eing. Yeah, yeah. Um, some maps to, are so small. Like the, some maps are so small you can't do it. One right, fruit, right. Like what the hell do you do? Um, depends on her build because they're definitely like if Fiora misses repost or she doesn't mm -hmm. have MR, then Annie does just kill her. Like mm -hmm, mm -hmm. drops Tibbers and you know if she misses repost, it's over. Um, obviously Rost doesn't lose. Uh, Red Cane. Um, yeah. just does not lose to her. So I mean, yeah. there's that. Um, yeah, I think I think she's I think she's S. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Fizz. Hmm. I don't think he's too bad. Maybe like A tier. Yep. Because I think a. Uh, he has like he's very haste reliant, right? And he gets so much right. free haste. And mana is also not a problem in this game mode. Right. Like ever. 
Uh, mm -hmm. You have auto resets on the plants. Uh, yep. You kind of counter like the Z tier or S tier champions and Z tier maybe as well because you can just trick stuff. Yes. And there's so much that can go well. Maybe a dual gauntlet's insane. That earthquake thing is ridiculous. Absolutely <laughs> insanity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Unpissed. Yep, yep, yep. insane. Like there's just so much that can go right as well. Yep. Like a, a yeah. maybe maybe S tier. I don't know. Maybe. Uh, what do you think? There's a think? lot of magic damage in the lobby. I think Fizz is gonna have a bad time. Yeah, 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 that's true, that's true as that's well. That's the, that's the issue, right? That's so, very true. Yeah, I didn't yeah. think of that. Um, okay, uh, Galio. I, I, I he's just yeah. terrible. He's actually yeah. just terrible. He's <laughs> yeah. absolutely D tier, he does nothing. Yeah. Uh, Gangplank. I think he's actually good. Yeah, I mean, I don't think, uh, crit scale is hard, but he can go, like, lethality crit, right, so. Yep, he can go lethality crit. Um, yeah. and there's a lot of augments that he can actually roll that yeah, I think are really true. stupid. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, and also he has W, which is really, mm -hmm. really good uh, against, like, Mordekaiser and some of the stuns and stuff. But he does just hard yeah. lose to, like, a lot of the ranged champions. So, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Um, Maybe, yeah. A? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, okay. Uh, Garoon. Uh, I think he's pretty shit. Like, uh, I think mid-game he's strong. Early game he's okay. Yeah. But I don't think he scales very hard. Like, I think he just gets one-tapped yeah. by anything. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Nar. I don't really think he's tanky enough to just go in and see, see people. I feel like he shines right. more when there's like more players, so it's yep. like underwhelming. Yep. Okay. Uh, Gragus. <laughs> I think Gragus would be a lot stronger if the Impregnator build worked, but they... What? Just... <laughs> yeah. You heard me. <laughs> what? What's going on you don't here? You know the Impregnator build? What? What the fuck are you uh, saying? Okay, listen. When he gets a certain ability, he has break point, then he has E perma stuns. <laughs> That's the impregnator build. He just oh, permanent like ease and he goes, buddy. So he has to roll really specific augments. <laughs> mm, I mean, you just get you get so much haste in this, but it doesn't work. It doesn't work because your e three cooldowns, uh, three seconds cooldown doesn't work. Like if you land it, you don't get like uh, refunded. So okay. I I don't know. I don't know how to feel about it. I feel like he's just like whatever, like echo. All right, I'll put him. C. What do you think? Yeah. I okay. think he's C. Yeah. Uh, oh, Graves. Okay. Uh, I think Grace can scale really hard. Like the mm -hmm. lifesteal Grace build, I think um, like tanky comps and mm -hmm. bruiser comps, he just completely invalidates. But he gets like super countered as well by like the Asol stuff or any stuff. Right. Like, so I think I he's a. He plays into that kind of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Um, Gwen. Uh, I think Gwen is fine. Honestly, I haven't really seen her too much, but because you get so high economy, I can't really imagine her being too bad. It's kind of hard to yeah, play against. Yeah. Six item Gwen is. So. Right, right, yeah. right. Six item Gwen is going to be really scary. Um, mm -hmm. I think she's probably A. Yeah, I can okay. get behind that. Yeah. Hecarim? I think Hecarim's uber dog shit. You can't yep. really like, stack your, your Q yep. on anything, so yep. you're just depressed. <laughs> All right, here, here we fucking go. Heimer Donger. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, what are we thinking? I think he's fucking Z tier. Yeah, the plant control is just something else. All right. <laughs> It's so unenjoyable playing against this. Like, his plant control, his poke, his anti-engage, the fact that, it, like, he, he, there's so many augments that he can end up going. There's so many yeah. different ways that he can do his AP yeah. optimization. He comes with Zanyas. Like, it's just not fair. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's actually no fun. not it's fair. It's never fun. No matter what you're playing, you see Heimer and you're like, yeah, okay, man. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. There, there's no fun against Heimerdinger. Yeah. Um, yeah, it, it's very, very, very rough. I, I, th I think he is just a Z. Yeah. Um, Alawi. Uh, I don't know. I, I think she's good against melees, but uh, I feel like everything, like Graves just does better, or like Gwen just does better into melees, or like, there's just there's just better than her. What do you think? Um, I know that Unforgiven, for instance, really yeah. thinks that she's better. Um, okay. But I think it's because like when me and him were duoing a lot, we ran into a lot of poppies. We ran into yeah. a lot of Alistars. We ran into a yeah, lot of Singes, I mean, like the, these things, right? Dream, right? Yeah. Right, right, exactly, exactly. So I, I think like maybe his view was skewed by the fact that we were just mm -hmm. getting Omega matchups for her. Um, yeah, I, like I've played Asol and it's like, okay, Lawi, what's she going to do? I press my E, she, this right. imp, she's stuck in the web. <laughs> right, 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 right. There, I think there's very little that she can do. Yeah. Correct, correct. Uh, okay, Aurel King. <clears throat> Aurel King. Yeah, I mean, what's she going to do? She can't stack her passive. She, she's terrible. She's absolutely yeah. terrible. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, Ivern. I think Ivern's pretty good. I think late, late game he gets outscaled because Daisy just gets one hit by everything because yes. damage scales so hard. Yep. But I think he can consistently be very, very strong. And he can go like Enchanter and he can also go AP. So 
it's very obnoxious to play against him no matter what you're playing. Uh, do you think he goes in unique? Because he has mostly only pairings. Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, yeah, I'd put him in unique here. I feel like there's some pairings with him that are just really, really, really powerful. Um, but mm -hmm. like as a standalone champion, there's other enchanters that you just take, like Karma. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, so I, I would put him in the unique tier. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Janna. Yeah, she's just fucking don't. Yeah, I mean, okay. sure, she will counter. I mean, she'll counter stuff like Rengar, but that's that's like that, Rengar, that, that's pretty much Ace it, right? Like, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like if you just think about Ace versus Janna, it's just misery. Right. Okay. Um, Yarvin. I don't know. I haven't seen him, but you know, with Axiom Arc being so good and he has like good lethality scaling, so he got buffed a while back. Right. I feel like maybe he can nuke, but I also think that Zonius is just so OP that it'll just be like he'll do, he'll do his thing, he'll shoot his load, and then you'll. Yeah, whoever hits first. Yeah. Right, right, right. <laughs> yeah. I think he's probably like. Uh, C? Yeah, yeah. I'd say that too. Yeah. Two glass cannon eat Jax. Mm hmm. Uh, I think Jax is kind of scary, honestly. I feel like. Um... Like on a hit, and he gets like very tanky. Like he's super good into melee champions. I wouldn't mm. put him in S maybe, but I'd say like maybe eight here, right? Because uh, like Bork is, is is so strong in this, and like he can right. go like rage played Bork and still be tanky. And he's got like uh, stuns and shit. And I don't know. I feel like he's kind of scary. I think like a lot okay. can go right. Okay. Yeah. No, I I I find I'm fine. Yep. Jace. I think he's. D. I think Jace. Or are you gonna D? say he's good? I think he's D. Uh, he's D tier. No, he's D tier. He's ridiculous, dude. You can get like double QE as early as like super early because you, there's so much haste. Forty ability haste shoes. Your mana you gives you a shit ton. Your mana you, you, you never run out of mana. He just gets got, smoked. Uh, no way, dude. I on God, dude. I was playing this guy on 180 ping, and you know Vlad OTPs do not make good Jace players, and I was clapping, dude. Oh, dude, dude my, this it shit was iron. Crazy. <laughs> nah, dude, I, I'm telling you, Jay, there's, there's no, no way. way. <laughs> I just hate it. Are you not. serious? Dude, Jace is so good. Dude, lethality items scale so hard. Lethality items scale so hard. He's just gonna get smorked. Okay, okay he, does, he, does counter, he does counter Shaco and Dinger. Yeah. Well, kind of, kind of. Well, um, how do you play, like, any... How do you play the S-tier champion into Jace? I feel like it's impossible. Okay, well, yes. All right, so 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 Fiora can't play against him, um, yes. right? Because obviously Jace has an ally. Mundo yeah. can if the yeah. lobby is AD heavy. Mm -hmm. uh, Mundo can. Brand can't. Okay, I, I agree with you. Yeah, there. he can't. Like the thing is, you um, get so much. Haste, Aurelian Soul is whoever that, hits first. I don't know. I, I think I think it's so long range, and the fact that you can get two QEs so early, like before you even start bleeding damage, like you can get that so so early. Like, like you, you can just like completely just range people. Okay, to what, what if what if Annie has and, flash? Oh, okay, you have Edge of Night. But what if Annie yeah, is a you, human? And what if Annie's a human and just yeah. starts with three charges and then flash WRs? Think about it. How do you start with three charges? By that time that you already because you, like, you W and stun? then you get four charges. You pop the yeah, Edge but, of Night and then you. But but by the time that you do that, wouldn't Jace already have blasted three loads on you? Not if she has flash. You're telling me Annie can uh, use her stun or like waste it to get three stacks? Th three no, no, times. No, no, that's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. So Annie starts the round with stun, right? Yes. So, okay, that's the problem. So, what Annie has to do as soon as the round starts is yeah. what? She has to just instantly press W as soon as the round starts. Then she has yeah, to press yeah. E. So now she's yeah. at one stack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The next W? Then she has to W again. But what's yeah. her ability? I mean, I guess it depends on the map. If the map is big enough, she can get to the three and then run at yeah. Jace. I just think, I think Jace is, I, I honestly think Jace is going to be like Ezreal tier when it comes to Oh like, my, God. don't do no, it to me. Really. No, I'm serious. Okay, I'm but serious. he's going to, all right. So the, 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 the same argument though that we're making earlier, he's going to bleed HP early. You think? I feel like he's not even that weak because his lethality uh, item is so broken it's so unbelievably broken early, and you can oh, maybe he's actually just good against tech. some of the pairings. You, oh my god! You, I think you, when you look, I think when we tech. play later or whatever, you have to play Jace. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta okay. convince me. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. All right. Yeah, dude. If I convince you, but if I elite Jace convinces you, oh then this champion my needs god! <laughs> all right, all right, all right. 
Oh, okay. Uh, I'm not giving him Z, but I'll, I'm giving him okay. S. Okay, okay. I swear to God, the thing is, like, the lethality champions just scale so hard. Yeah, it's I can't disgusting. Even imagine. Yes. Dude, if Ghostblade gets fixed where it actually gives lethality, can you imagine, dude? That shit, no, I like, can't imagine. The That's the whole point. Yeah. 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 Okay. Ouch. Ouch. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. L l let's cook right. a little bit. All Jin. Right. Right. Absolutely horrible. 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 <laughs> He's so fucking bad. The right. only time right. I saw Jin and thought maybe he was okay, it was a Jin Shaco comp. Okay. Yeah, with the traps and stuff. Or yes, it was. Yeah, yeah it, okay. it was. It was just yeah. Jin. It was. It was trap spam, yeah. W spam, and Jin. Yeah, uh, Jin W's so like. Yeah. It was absolute like. There was no way to win on the uh, the pillar map and the snow map. Yeah, yeah. There was no way. You just get cut off. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it was really weird. At least with the comp that was had. Um, maybe like obviously like Kane can probably just rush even even with Chaco's there. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, but I don't know. I mean, I think Jin. Jin, Jin's pretty bad, man. All right, all right. Jinx, mm -hmm. Jinx, Jinx. She's D two. Yeah, I think all these like crit champions just scale so terribly. Like... Yeah. And they do so badly. Maybe well. maybe Jinx Milio is a combo on really low ping. Mm, yeah, but it wouldn't just like Cogma just Tail's be so much better. better. Yeah, or Cog, Lucian. Cog and Kale. Like, yeah, even yeah. with like lethality, like with his okay, axiom arc. Don't go, don't go that far. What, what, are we, what are we? Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah, Cassante. Okay. Cassante. Yeah, terrible. I, I don't know. I don't know if it's like because you don't get like attack speed or something in this, or I, it just feels so bad to play. And Qs are impossible to land on this ping, so. I don't know. I and also his, his R, yeah, he just doesn't yeah, feel, so, he does not feel yeah. uh, amazing. I think he's, yeah, I think he's pretty bad. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Kai'Sa. Listen, all these top players are spamming Kai'Sa, yeah. but I do not see the divine god in her. I think she's like maybe S tier or A tier, but I don't think that she's Z tier. I, like, I feel like, yeah, yeah it's a low range ADC. Sure, she does a lot of damage. Sure, she's like independent. She doesn't really need like peeling, right? Uh, right. She's like... She's a noob stomper because maybe people like isolate into her or like she's strong early, but I, I don't think she's like that insane. Like everyone always says like, oh, she's so Z tier, but those are the same tier lists that put ASOL like so low. So, right, 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 right. It's so whatever, um, right? Like, I agree with you. So she can itemize in several different ways, which is like mm -hmm. same advantages yeah, as real. Um, yeah. If she sees a team comp has a lot of turtle comps, um, yeah. she can go AP. Yeah, that's obnoxious. Um, So that's really good. She does have self peel mm -hmm. and evasion. Uh, but yeah, I completely agree with you. I, I saw a lot of the top players are all playing Kai'Sa, and they're playing, like, yeah. Kai'Sa combos with, like, Braum, yeah. Yeah. uh, or, like, other things, and they're just doing that. But every time I see them play, it's just, like, the people they're playing against are, just have no yeah. idea what yeah. day of the week it is. <laughs> so, like, I, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't yeah. think she's very I, good. I, I, yeah, um, I so, at least though. compared to the, the Zs. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Callista. Absolutely terrible. Yep. It's just a uh, experience. Yeah. Karma. Uh, I'd say A, maybe S, because of her, like, enchanters are kind of crazy. I feel like when they can put shields on like crazy, I think, um, like, all the heal shield power stuff is yep. ridiculous. The, the, yep. You know, like, on Summoner's Rift, to get, like, at least some heal shield power, it feels like you have to invest quite a bit. But you spawn into the game with a thousand gold item that's 20% heal and shield power. That's insane. Right, it's not balanced. Right, it's not yeah. balanced at all. And yep. it's not even like, oh, your ADC dies. Oh, now I die as well. Fuck it. Right. I'm going to be right. the paladin now, and I'm going to fucking super drain you now. Like... Right. It's actually crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and and I imagine on low ping, she's going to be a lot better. Huh? Yeah. yeah. You, you could also go Leandri's, like, if, if yeah. there's, like, 5 million health and... All right, cartoon. Uh, Ego Sander said he was not that good, but I, I don't know. I feel like you can just ult at the start, and it's like uh, HP tax yes, or Zonia tax. Yes, or that, was, tax. that was my logic with him, yeah. is he can ult at the start of the match, yeah, and then he can tax. get his ult back. Mm -hmm. So he has two ults per round. Um, yeah. His W is really obnoxious, and mm -hmm. he can just die on top of a plant, which is like, painful yeah, for the opponents yeah, yeah that's, that's you know what so i mean obnoxious. yeah that's so obnoxious he's also good against shaco bad against heimer um i, mean, I just really it, it really in, depends right? can, i mean you have to you, you basically have to be suicide karthus in the game yeah always um i think he's like a yeah i can see it uh, like he also likes going leandris and it's like yep. unbelievably broken in this yeah like, he likes going the burn builds and stuff yeah like I think there's a okay. lot that can go right. Like you get the hundred slow extra, and then you get the rallies, and you just walk into them, and it's like yeah. Right. Nice. Okay. Uh, yeah. Kassadin. 
well, absolutely <laughs> terrible. <laughs> this is bad. Compared to the well, wait, maybe maybe there's like maybe there's some tech that we're just missing. Maybe maybe Kostin can get his R to like zero point three seconds and he just like yeah, fucking. I've, I've tried to make it work, but you've tried to. It's okay, okay. like so late game augment dependent, and then you also Six have item. open hunter for the early game, and then you also yeah. don't have seraphs, and then you have to go. You don't have tier early game, so it's just oh, like so it's, okay. Hurts. You're right. You're right. Yeah. So much okay. Pain. Oh, you can get the 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 rod of ages plus you keep gaining level thing, right? Yeah, but that's one in ten games, and then uh, True. the other nine games you got third All place. Right. So you're yeah. The thing Cat is, evolved. when you're when you're, when you're like super high low as well, you can't afford to lose one game every five games. You True. have to win. You have to keep winning because you yeah. lose so much LP. I don't know how yeah. the ranked like MMR is going to work on live, but if it's the same as now, where if I'm like eight K LP and I lose one game, I get minus two hundred, and if I win one, I get thirty two. Like yeah, my bad. That's gonna be you rough. Yeah. Yeah, you can't drop games. Yeah. yeah. Um, I don't know. Okay, Cat Evolved. Uh, I haven't really seen any of them of her. What do you think? Um, like she's so many on hits builds, and there's so much. OP I haven't on seen her once. Right now, but yeah, I really don't know. But even though she has so many on hit builds and she has all these yeah. things, better against AOE, like against more people, or I, I just don't know. I like I, I feel like so many of the champions that are really high mm -hmm. up just ruin her day. Yeah, I think so. Like well. even regardless of how she can itemize, because of the fact that she has to commit. Um, mm -hmm. so I don't like her. I really don't. I think that she's like D. Yeah, yeah. Right, I can get behind that. Okay. Um, Kale. All right. Now this is the better Kaiser. Now this is the fucking sauce. True. I'm telling you. True. Kale true. 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 Ridiculous. True. True. You can true. go serrated Dirk. You can go serrated mm. Dirk. Ult your ally, then eat a plant, and then you got another <laughs> ult. What is that? How do you play? What's going on? And then now Kale's buffed as well. Let him cook. So you also c can like um. Auto hit during your ult, you don't even have to ult your ally. It enables your 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 uh, friend to play like a complete maniac. Um, mm -hmm. Every uh, item in the game is is your oyster. Thief's glove. Oh my god, I'm so fucking happy I rolled this. Um, Zephyr is the most broken item in the game. It gives you 50 million stats for some reason. God knows why. <laughs> oh yeah, what's that? Every item in the game has an AP scaling for no reason. Oh, what's that? Nash's tooth has a has a fucking physical damage scaling. How does that make sense? Legit, Let her everything cook. is perfect. Everything's yeah. perfect for Kaylin. She does too much like, damage. Sure. Yeah, and she has so many parents. Like, okay, maybe she's bad early game with a little tempo prank. She has insta insane attack speed steroid with your E. She can eat yeah. plants insanely quick. You can start boots and be like obnoxious as hell. Uh, mm -hmm. Flea is OP as hell, so you can just move away like perma. Is yeah. I think she's really, really ridiculous. Yep. 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 She's and she comes so with red too. So yeah. it, it's, it's, it's no very gross. Yeah. 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 Kale, Kale's very, very gross. All right, here we fucking go. Here we are. Wow, Ross. No, no talk. This is no, no argument. There is literally... He actually... Yeah. You know what? I'm just adding another fucking tier. <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm just actually okay, adding a tier. Hold on. Let me, let me fucking... Let me just... Oh, shit. Hold on. Mm. Let, me, let me make sure that this tier just moves all the fucking way up. All right, Ooh. here we go. We're just going to leave that there, okay? Yeah. We're just going to fucking leave I mean, that there. I think uh So, some... okay, so here's the thing. He does he does definitely have counters. Yeah, exactly, exactly. He does. Um yeah. but I feel like because of his existence, if he's not mm -hmm. banned, you either yeah. have to play him or you have to play his counters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Otherwise, um, it's over. And his counters, I don't know how you feel, but I feel like they're all skill. They're not like hard. Yeah. Yes. So, so it's not balanced. It's just, it's mm -hmm. absolutely not balanced. Now, I haven't seen Shadow Kane um, yeah, at all, but Rost is, is not, he's just not fair. Like, yeah, actually yeah. not fair. So, I, yeah. like, I, I don't know. Yeah, it's just not balanced. It's, re it's really not. Um, yeah. He warps the entire thing around him, uh, the pick ban yeah. phase. So, yeah. you know, it, it is what it is. All right. Uh okay, so right, let's see. Uh, cannon. Uh, who? I don't know. I I think um, like sure he doesn't have like max health damage, but I feel like he still has huge utility that it's really hard to play against him when he gets his proto belt and he gets his like uh, sixty five AP item 
and yeah. his pen boots because then you have like 40 magic pen it's similar to vlad where you just deal yeah. so unbelievably much damage that right even though he shouldn't really be that strong because no leandry's no max health no nothing to counter that kind of stuff i think she's he's still pretty strong what yeah. do you think yeah no i i totally agree with yeah. with canon i think i think he's like a tier because mm -hmm. he's gonna be really combo dependent mm -hmm. and the the issue is is that until he gets a lot of those items and he gets all that utility, I think he does just lose rounds to mm -hmm. S and Zs, um, yeah, and then him. Yeah. So you know, it's it's just yeah. how it goes. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think so. he's like A. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, Kha'Zix, terrible, no isolation. What? I I think he's terrible. There's no isolation. There's no isolation. I mean, he can't get it. How do you get it? somehow someone's gonna not walk next to each other surely you don't like i guess maybe in unique then at least because of Mordekaiser, oh, you, you what with QSS. mordekaiser yeah and okay and then they Hello, and then they qss but... mords are then what uh then you had to buy a qss and he still does five million damage because lethality champions are busted no he's not good he's oh, so bad okay. I, mean, oh, I mean i don't know i haven't really seen him that much but i can imagine him to be really strong i would have thought so Okay, we're all right. Fine, we'll fucking we'll do it later. Uh, we can do more okay. more fucking. Yeah, I, but I'm putting him in D. So look, okay. I gave you Jace, and but I'm yeah, killing the okay. fucking bug. I mean, I'm okay. killing the fucking. I'm putting my foot down, man. Anything to make Jace higher. All right. Jace is okay, busted. Kindred. Uh, I think she's very unique combo reliant, right? Like Tarek, um, uh... She is really unique, but yeah. the problem that she, I have with yeah. her uniqueness is, mm -hmm. uh, so okay. If she has Tarek, then she beats Kane. Yeah. Um, so there's that. If she has Tarek, she beats Kane. If she has Kale, she can also potentially beat Kane. Or actually, yep. she does beat Kane if she has Kale. Um, yeah. So she has some combo pairings where she does beat Kane, and mm -hmm. you have to basically be the range champions to beat her because she gets infinite stacks. Mm -hmm. um, but then she outranges the range champ. So it it's like really weird. I want to put Kindred at like Z. Mm-hmm. Um, because she, one, she can beat Kane, and then two, I mean, I do think Kindred Tarek might actually, kin, Kindred Tarek, Kindred Kale, I think, I don't know how to feel about it. Maybe on really low yeah. ping. Um, yeah. Maybe on, well, I don't even know, because Kale's just going to speed her up, and she's going to fucking have 12 stacks running at Ezreal. Yeah, like, I don't know what's going to happen. really obnoxious, I can imagine. And she also beats champs that want to knock her, or like, want to outlast for the fire ring, because she, her right. ult stops the fire damage, and then you can pair it with, like, Alistar, and it's just... Yeah. Right, 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 right. So, uh, I don't know, man. Kindred, I think uh, unique. I think unique. I think she's because, unique, yeah. but it's like, it's like, She's actually up. She she's above Z, but like below Kane. Yeah. In her as a standalone. I mean, as a standalone. It's it's weird because crit ADCs are so bad in this, but she's also really strong. Like yeah, just as a standalone as well. Yep. Ah, she combines too many things. That's why. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay, Kled. I think he's underrated. Lethality is fucking crazy. Yep. He's yep. so unbelievably obnoxious early game. Like you cannot kill him while he dismounts as two players yes. in the early game. You just don't have enough damage. Everyone has so high health, it's just yep. impossible. Completely he always agree. gets two mounts. Uh, he invalidates comps like Aesol because like, you just he can pedal into it. Yeah, it's so hard to play against him. I, I don't know. M yep. Maybe S tier. Maybe. I feel like he's yeah, just I really counter. And it's not even like um, like the counter of his counter, which is like uh, low mobility, smart champions. Right. Like he, he still shits on that as well. Yeah, because his lethality is so insane. Eclipse is so crazy, right? Right, right, right. Yeah, and you eat plants quickly. You get that yep. OP at Dirk as well. Like exactly, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Okay. Uh, Cogmaw. Uh, unique maybe. Unique. Yeah, he's yeah. just unique. I mean, obviously, he has yeah. the Milio pairing. Um, mm -hmm. yeah, he has Milio. He has Kale pairing. Um, I don't know what else he has. I guess he has. I guess he has Tarek. He has Brom. Um, mm -hmm. these things. He only has pairings though. That's his problem. Yeah, yeah I think so. Um, maybe on low ping it's gonna be really weird, and uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Like, depending on how bans go, like in a, in a world where like Kindred is banned, mm -hmm. uh, and and Kane is open, yeah. you know what I mean? Like stuff like this. Like I, I don't yeah. know. Well, I don't know because if, if if Kane's open and Kale's open, then they just go Kale Kane, and then Cog Kale loses. So I, yeah, I don't yeah, know. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's weird. Uh, LeBlanc. I wouldn't have 
thought that she's anyhow does anything better than regular because everyone's so high t- like right. health and right. early game. Yeah, I think, I, think, I think she's like D. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Lee Sin. I think Lee Sin's pretty good, honestly. Uh, I think right now it's hard to see because of the high ping, but um, Lee Sin has just so many... Like, he just gets so strong with, it, with items. Like I feel like it's the same as Elise, right? Where you so sure on Summoner's Rift, she had no economy. Like Of course, yeah. he doesn't scale. But here, you just get the same money. You win early game on this for sure. You can help your ally. You got yeah, you win, you you win got early game. Easy. Got, yeah. uh, flash every two rounds. Do- means yeah. Insect every two rounds. So you can force force win kind of sometimes. So I think he's pretty strong, honestly. Um, I don't know about yeah. putting him S because I think he falls off temporarily. Yeah. yeah. Um, I don't know. What, what... But he does, he does push people early. He does hit people's... Uh, mm-hmm. Life bars. It's, it's not even like he's like useless late game that he's just like he's right, nothing. right, right, right. Is tanky as hell. He will deal insane damage if he has certain right. lethality items and they don't have right, that, right, like right. armor. Then and... okay, he has the Omni Vamp. Yeah, his uh, Axiom Arc is incredible as well. Like yeah, Blood damp. Okay, uh, Leona. Ooh, I don't really feel like she does anything more special than like Alistar. She is Omega gimmicky. Uh, yeah, I feel like if you roll mm-hmm. all of the ability haste augments. Yeah. Um, I think it gets a little bit disgusting. Um, yeah. but if you don't do that, <laughs> then world. she just sucks. Yep. Yeah. Um, I'd put her like C. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, Lilia, I have not seen her once. I've seen her, but it was kind of depressing because she can't really ramp up. So. She so, can't ramp up. Like loses all rounds Hector. early. Yeah, it's like Hector. the ring of fire restricts her, mm-hmm. and then some maps are just too small. Yeah. So I think you'd never pick Lilia. I think she's just D. Yeah, I think she's probably strong against tanks with Leandris, but yeah. What what does Lily do into like Aesol or any or right, right, any like other range champ? Yeah. The loft. Yeah. Uh, Lissandra. Oh, I think also pretty terrible. Can't really yep. deal with healthy tanks. Yep. Or healthy targets. Uh, everyone has high yep. health, which is whatever. Invalidated yep. by like balance. Yep. Uh, Lucian. I I don't know. I haven't really seen him. Um, maybe unique pairings. Uh, I can imagine his. I thought maybe something like, like there was one Lucian who had like a pretty shitty build and he R'd me and I was like half life and I was like, okay, well this feels pretty terrible now. Yeah, I didn't yeah, have yeah, like yeah. Axiom Arc or anything like that. So maybe there's like some cheesy so, ass Axiom Arc type shit and then he just blasts you. So I wonder what happens in like a so hypothetical like Lucian Kane matchup, right? Yeah. Where it's six item, six item, but he has Axiom yeah. Arc and with his E plus his R plus Flash. Yeah, yeah. And Gale Does Force Kane maybe, actually maybe. like struggle to get close and like so, you yeah. know what I mean? Like, but mm-hmm. then as soon as Lucian grabs him, I mean it's over. Or I mean as soon as Kane can grab Lucian once, it's over. So yeah, um, yeah, I don't know. Um, yeah, yeah, I think Unique is good. Uh, yeah. Lulu. I don't know. I think it's very underwhelming. I, I don't. Yeah, think I she think does it's extremely anything. underwhelming. Yep. Yeah. I think she's yeah. the D tier enchanter. I think she's the enchanter that you don't play. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Lux. I've only seen it once. Uh, I don't know. I feel like her magic pen can go pretty crazy, and she controls zones very well with her yes. um, big AOE thing. Mm-hmm. I don't think she's too bad. I don't think she's weak early either, so she she's got that. But yeah, yeah, it's I'd not like she does beat. anything crazy well. Like, yeah, uh, I can yeah, I can imagine like with warm routine or something like that, that like she becomes really scary. Mm-hmm. Uh, but it's just so like you need to hit your abilities. Or I mean, she also insta used. loses to QSS though. Yeah. True. Versus uh, any of the Smork champions, she just insta loses. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, you just die. You it, sit down and yeah, die. there's nothing to do. Um, yeah, uh, yeah. Actually, for that reason, I think I'm gonna put her C. Um, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, Malphite. The only time I, I ever saw a Malphite top two. Okay, the only time. Yeah. Yeah. He was paired with the Yasuo. Yeah. And they both had. Um, you get your ultimate back after using it. Oh, that's hilarious. Damn, that's such a cool so, combo. Holy. So, it they, was, they, it they was the bounce the house. Their life, man. Holy it moly. was the bounce house. But they got Dude. second. Dude, <laughs> so, I'm, getting, like, I don't... I'm getting like secondhand dopamine just imagining the situation. Like They're both like smiling. They got the pristine arguments. Yo, what did you get? What did you get? Oh, yeah. I got the ultimate for us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're just sitting there like, let's go. Um... Yeah, I, I, I mean, I think, I think he's pretty bad. There's yeah. too much magic in the absolute top tiers. He can't itemize the way that he wants to. Um, wants, like, Yasuo. Uh, too susceptible to, like, all of the zone control comps. It's just too mm-hmm. bad. Mm-hmm. Yep. All right. 
Malzahar. Okay, I th I've played a lot of Malzahar and I've paired him with so many different things. I think he's S tier, maybe Z tier because a lot of things can go right with him. Um, he shits on like stuff like uh, that, like wants to go in, like he just puts his dot on somebody, and yeah, you feel like shit now because your the Leandris ticks just ticks for fucking five million in this game mode, and yes. uh, his pets are insane. Uh, you know slog dogs? No. Okay, oh, the Yorick. Like a, yeah, 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 yeah. I played yeah. with him and Yorick, and Yorick is a horrendous pre six because you don't have any ghouls. But as soon as we hit level six, it's just we just completely it's so much shit block skill shots, everybody. right? It's insane because he boxes yeah. someone in on a like, and it's impossible to dodge because some maps are just tight corridors. And yeah. then you can silence for free. You get your Ws, all the minions. There's like, there's literally, yeah. oh, like he gets five minions, I get like ten. Yeah. There's like fifteen things like hitting so you, eating your ass, and you're like, ah, oh, ah, oh, what the fuck? And you're like stuck in the box. You're shining your duo. Please help me! I need. To, I'm stuck. And then Mazda just does his laser at you, and you're just fucked. <laughs> it's just like, my goodness. And then pristine augments come, and you think, okay, yeah, I'm feeling good. Uh, I I become immortal when I get my ult. I'm feeling good right now. And then you press tab. You look at Mazda's augment. Oh yeah, ultimate revolution. He's got two ults now. Yeah, yeah, my yeah, QSS yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot right now. I, I think I yeah. think my QSS is really good right now. And then you so, see, then you see you go into a game and you see the Mazda walk at you with a black shield. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. So okay, so Malzar is really interesting. And so I was having this conversation with Griffin because Griffin oh. thinks that Kindred Kale or Kindred Tarek beats Malzahar. Um yeah. but I'm not actually sure if they do. Um because I think it depends on the augments. Now the yeah. reason so, obviously, I saw a couple of tier lists, and they all had Malzahar really low. And I was really upset because what? I've been using the fuck out of Malzahar. Yeah, I've been yeah he's I've, insane. He's so broken. He's, the mo he's yeah. one of the most disgusting things in the world. Um, yeah. So, but also, the reason that I started playing Malzahar is because he beats Kane. Yeah, so, legit. So, Kane has to go QSS, but he can't do it until the final rounds. Mm -hmm. So, because he can't That's do it until the final <laughs> rounds, you're always top two, which means you're getting LP. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But... On low ping, it's going to be a spacing battle. Does Malzahar hit yeah. the Q to pop the Edge of Night? Yeah. And then Kane has, uh, Kane has QSS, sure, but Malzahar has Rylize. So, like, if he hits mm -hmm. him at max range, and then there's the Voidlings, if Malzahar dodges the, yeah, uh, the W, then he wins. Legs are broken. Yep. Right, then he wins. Then, then, then Ross loses. Like, it, mm -hmm. but... So, I think it's going to be skill. But I do acknowledge he auto-loses to Heimerdinger. Uh, later on, he auto loses to uh, Corky, auto loses to Ezreal, mm -hmm. um, yeah. Yeah. unless he has like Flash or something, or like depending on who his teammate is. But the thing yeah. is, is that he pairs so well with so many of yeah. the divers, and like yeah. Malzahar yeah. Rost is un like, I mean that's just <laughs> what the fuck is going on. Yeah, um, yeah, I think he's broken. I think he's absolutely yeah. broken. Um, so. okay, cool. Uh, Meow Kai. Uh, I mean. I think he's can be insanely obnoxious if the stars align for you, but otherwise he's just like a regular tank, right? And I don't think tanks right. do that much in this mode because damage just scales so much better. There's, there's so many little things like, uh, oh, enemy rolled um, with the thread the needle or whatever it's called, where you get like armor pen or erosion or anything like that, and yeah. all of a sudden you're like half health perma. Right. Like you just you spawn to the game with like half your health bar. Right. Like I think every like Z tier champion just insta kills him. Feels like. Yeah. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, I think, yeah, I think he's just don't. I mean, okay. Uh, uh, if you get like Courage of the Colossus and you fuck your heart steel and you have your Fimble Winter, then maybe you like your Yeah, if you didn't die you fucking trying to hit yeah. them before that, you know, yeah. like, <laughs> like yeah. what? Yeah. what is going yeah. on? Um, yeah. okay. Uh, maybe, maybe there's like combos with him that we're not understanding where he's full AP and he just mm -hmm. R's. Yeah. Um, but I don't know. Uh, I, I'm is, doubtful. You can also run to a plant and then R and then just R again and it's kind of hard to play against. But yeah, that's yeah. true. Uh maybe he's actually better than me. Uh, I'll give him B. Like that R is just impossible to dodge in the small. Yeah, it's an, it's like, impossible. Yeah, it. yeah. Um. Okay, Master Yi. Uh, I think Master Yi is pretty ridiculous. I think yep. if it's a little bit of goes right for him, it's just so hard to win in the lobby, especially with Tarik. Yes. Uh, like he gets scope weapons and he's got Bluetooth auto hits. Yeah. G -g yep. G -g Yep, yep, yep. So he does need to roll some augments. He does need certain pairings. So I'm putting him in a unique. But mm -hmm. in terms of power level, he's absolutely Z. Yeah, he could just go crazy. Yep, yep. Um, but 
some of the other ridiculous combo pairings, I think that his pairings just auto lose to. Okay, what beats Yi Tarek? Kindred Tarek. Okay, yeah, I can get behind that. Yeah, Kin Kindred Tarek, um, Ross Tarek, Ro you know, like the these types mm -hmm. of things. Um, yeah, these types of things. Um, okay, uh, Milio, he's just I unique. Think, uh... Yeah, I think like yeah. enchanters are generally not the best unless you have like right. insane shields like Karma. But right. I think Milio has a unique option which gives range, so maybe mm -hmm. that's like not too bad. Yeah. Uh, Miss Fortune. I think it's really gimmicky. Like it's just yes. If you want to get Jewel Gauntlet and Ult, then that's cool. But uh, good luck getting it right. Outside of that, yeah, I think she's D. Okay. Yeah. Mordekaiser. Yeah, I I think Mordekaiser is pretty crazy. I, like, so, I, you've seen the Talon build, yeah? You've yeah, seen yeah, yeah. I've seen. I, I played yeah. it. I played it. Oh um, my goodness! So, the only thing for me is yeah. on high ping or on really low ping. Yeah. You're never hitting E. Yeah. Um, especially early. You're. I don't think you're ever hitting E versus a lot of champions. Um, even with the the Paladin build, does he actually beat the the super like broken combos? I don't think so. Mm. I just think he can do so much. Like he, he gets yeah, he can, so he can, many. He has multiple shields. build variations. Yeah. You do you think he's actually a Z tier? Uh, I don't know. I don't put him Z. There's, there's just some times where he's like he can just mummy two, walk up, and kill everything. Like I had a right. game earlier where it was like Timo Heimer, and uh, I lost it, but I misplayed it. But the team had to buy Serpent's Fang, otherwise I was legit unkillable. And if I played it mm -hmm. perfectly with like my Kindle to my um timing on my uh, redemption which also is a right. full heal for both your champions like guaranteed right. and, and you have to like it's you have to buy serpent's fang you have to buy healing reduction you have to buy a qss uh you're not allowed to be an ap champion otherwise you feel really badly by buying those items right right um the other guy is also semi unkillable uh it's just so obnoxious like, right i think he's fucking strong okay uh yeah no, I mean, I, I, I agree with everything that you're saying. Um, yeah. I, I, I just, I feel like on really low ping, he's going to have a lot of problems. I think he's going to have a lot of problems early. Um, he does have some augment dependency, which is one of the things that I don't like. Really? He does, doesn't I think, he? I, I think if he For wants the Paladin to be an independent, build. if he wants to be an independent Superman, like, then you get, need to get the Circle of Life thing, right? To just kill people. Circle but that, of death, that, no? You just win the game then. Yeah, Circle of Death. You just, you just yeah. win the game when you get that. Like, it's just yeah. an instant lovey win. But... Mm -hmm. Without that, you're still insanely obnoxious. Like you can. Do so you think like, he's actually Z? Oh, I think he's not. Maybe not Z without all, certain augments, but uh, right. That's that's why I'm having a mess. So, yeah, 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 yeah. I think. Okay. Yeah. I think combined with Nila, though, that is ridiculous. I think that might be potentially one of the strongest because the amount of shields he gives her. Yeah. Literally, like, like five thousand shield, five thousand shield. It's like yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> what, yeah, right. What what do you do? Right, right, right. Okay. And then, like, he also makes him like uh, the Counter Strike thing. Uh, mm -hmm. Twenty five MR is like just really crazy. Right, right, right. Okay. Uh, Morgana. Uh, she's don't. Yeah. She is. Seen. She's something. She's yeah. yeah. Uh, Nami yeah. don't. Yeah, I'd say. So uh, well. Nasus don't. Do we even need yeah. to discuss that? Okay. Yeah. Uh, Nautilus don't. Yeah. Uh, Nico. Uh, uh, who? Uh, I, I I don't know if it's like meant to be, but. She can apparently, I've seen it in the game, she can clone herself to her clone and it doesn't break the disguise, so her health bar becomes tiny and it's really obnoxious. What? Like it, yeah, it's insanely annoying to play against because you've like no idea like which one's the real one. You've no idea if it's like dying or not because her health bar is so tiny on your screen. But uh, I don't know, I think it's underwhelming. Okay, I mean, it sounds really gimmicky. Uh, yeah, it's whatever. Okay. Uh, Nidalee. Nah, I don't know. You think she's good? No, I don't think she's good. I think she's yeah. terrible. Yeah. yeah. I think she's never going to do anything on looping. Mm -hmm. uh, Nila, she's unique. Yeah, 100%. She is, she is absolutely one of the best champions in the entire game, but she is hyper. 100%. Yeah. She, I played her so much with Lotharis, if you know him, yeah. and we just cleaned house every lobby like with the Paladin build. Like, it was yeah. just unbelievable. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, Nocturne. I don't know. I think it's kind of gimmicky, and you just get. Kind I, of really I think hard so. Here, here's zombies. my thoughts on Nocturne. Yeah. Um, he is better than Nefiri on uh one through five items, and then Nefiri is superior in Nocturne. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 
that that's exactly what he is. Mm -hmm. Um, I'll just put him at C. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, Nunu. I've never seen it. Have you played with Kesha? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> Thankfully, no. Uh, uh, listen, I played with Slug Dogs earlier and you picked Nunu, and there's a few crazy things that can happen. Like oh, like when the, when the map gets small and he R's? No, 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 no. Even oh. way crazier. Okay, you know, what was crazier? You know, castle? Oh, you castle when he's fully charged? Yes, that works. And it has no animation as well, so all of a sudden there's a Nunu in your face and it does like 3k nuke, it just one-shots you. That works. <laughs> Yeah, can you imagine a Shaco going invis and castling on you? He just died. No <laughs> time to play. He just Wait, died. Okay, so he, all right, but that, but so that he works. needs, yeah. And chauffeur works as well. You can drag him around while he's Nunu ulting. So you can, you can Shaco invis and then all of a sudden, Nunu ulting. Okay, okay, okay. That's pretty nasty. But like, it's so gimmicky. Outside of that, it must be so bad, no? Yeah, then it's terrible. Then it's terrible. The thing is, as well, oh. like, you can kind of go tank and then sell your items and go AP as well if you get your augments, right? Because in this game, where you sell I items guess. for so much. It's too gimmicky. It's too gimmicky. I'm putting him in yeah. C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. All right. Maybe, uh, maybe, put, maybe I'll put him in C, but we got to move uh, Jace up one tier. Half a tier, half a tier. That's the deal. Let him cook. Okay, bro off. Uh, uh, so shit. I think he's so, he's so bad. Yeah, he's yeah. really bad. Uh, Oriana. Also kind of dog shit. I think she's really bad, yeah. Yeah. Um, because even with ability haste and stuff, she still has to wait for the ball to move. Yeah, yeah. So it's like it's really awkward. Um, yeah, yeah, Orn. Yeah. Uh, I think Orn is potentially one of the best tanks. You yeah. know, tanks are kind of underwhelming, but yep. you just get so many stats, right? Because like, I th it's like the the thing with like uh, like Vlad passive, and those kind of champions where you get like X stat four X, or um, like because he just gets stats for fun and you get right. so many stats as well for fun it just amplifies itself so hard sometimes that you get crazy strong and it's not right. like he's like um dependent where right. oh yeah you don't deal damage if your guy dies you can still do some crazy shit so i think it's pretty fine okay. i think it's decent uh would you put him above b uh, it's hard to put even a tank above there but if there is one i'd say it's probably him right but it's just hard to put anything there because it's, just... it's hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, Pantheon. I think Pantheon's pretty good, honestly. Like you have really low um, cooldown CC. Like it's insane. Uh, your full build is kind of crazy. You do so unbelievably much damage, and you can beat him with him. You can you beat can do Rust. Him. Yes, if you E and How? move backwards, your ult does no damage, or his ult does no damage. That's if you sus. what? If you E. And then uh, move backwards. Then you're immune to him. Yeah. You heard it here. But wait a minute. But hold on. Hold on. Okay. So, so, okay. So when, when, okay. So when Rost comes out, you're behind. As long as you're moving backwards, it doesn't yes, hurt. Yes, while forwards. Yeah, it doesn't hurt. Okay. Though. That sounds like a tech that all, 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 all game men should know. So, <laughs> like, what? all right. So, <laughs> yeah, nothing, nothing, nothing. So... <laughs> Look. Okay, move on, um, move on. okay. So, so, but then what happens? So you're eing backwards, but then doesn't Ross just W? I mean, but if you have, uh, I don't know. I feel like you just stun him, or I don't think you just insta die from one W. You think? Yeah, you but did? your W has animation, and then his W goes off, and his healing goes through. I don't know. I, I think it's not as simple as I think. The only way he kills him like instantly is with a. Um... Is with an ult, which can't really okay. happen unless he gets the double ult. I, I think Pantheon's really fucking good in general, just because like he does so much damage later, and he's strong early as well, so he doesn't like bleed points as well. Like okay, you don't think he's good? I don't think he's well. I'm I'm just trying to see. I mean, all right, explain it to me. Explain it. Break it down. How he beats the Z and S's. Okay, uh, Annie, yeah. you can uh, like squish the enemies like together with your ult. I like either landing it on them or like closing off a choke hole or something like that or you just go in like a man what if she's on yours yeah then you you wait two seconds for your stun to come off go like you do it oh again man. your stun is literally oh two God. seconds no okay you can't get qss and stuff until later so aren't you just gonna lose all the mid rounds well, i don't know i think he's so strong with the clips like it's so buffed all right all right he, he all right heimer mouse how does he win uh yeah. I don't know. 
Yeah, okay, get the fuck out of here. Okay, he's A, he's A. He's A and okay. B. Okay, all right, yeah. all right, all right. Yeah, I don't mind, I don't mind. Dude. All right, Poppy. Put Jace up so, okay. yeah. Poppy, so this was one of the most disturbing things. Every yeah, fucking tier list had her super high that I saw. Oh, yeah, I mean, that's just the noob stumper. I press R and you die. Nice. It's the weirdest thing in the world. I, like, she's okay. Yeah, yeah. But she's pretty bad. She, she should not actually win a game, I think. Mm, no? I think she has a case, like, with Kled, where she runs down these, like, uh, super long-range mages like Aesol. Like, I don't know, you, yeah. you feel really shit as Aesol if that poppy just runs at you and starts seeing you. Like, you're just out of the game, basically, at that point. Right, right, right. So, I don't think he's, like, I don't think he's too bad, honestly. Like, okay. Maybe B, okay. A. <sighs> You just said if there's a you tank think... that that is yeah, higher I than mean, B, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think I think I'd rather have Orn. I'll be honest. Yeah, yeah, I, I can see that as well. Because also, if you have Orn and you get the, uh, you can have any number of mythics. Don't you get three upgrades? Does that work? Does that yeah. work? I, I'm pretty oh, sure. Yeah. Oh. I'm well, pretty sure. That, that's pretty nasty then. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how that works. It could be wrong. Uh, Pike, he's terrible. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, Pike is like... Pike is like. Like, like, okay, maybe if you double R every round and you yeah. have uh, executioner contract or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Maybe. And then somehow, yeah. well, no, still, you need to be level six before this, like, starts happening. But, like, yeah. okay, yeah, you can literally show up with a two-item advantage if you econ. Yeah. I th is, that, is that the way the math works? If you want every round, double pike R, contract killer, <laughs> and you... Only buy oh, yeah. the uh, lethality item, no boots. Maybe oh, there's a round where you show up with two items over the opponent. Yeah, but then you're still playing Pike. True. What nice point. All right, that's why he's D. That's why he's D. All right. <laughs> that's why. That's why he's fucking D, dude. All right. Uh, okay. Uh, Kiana. Hmm. I think her damage is pretty insane with the lethality items and Axiom Arc, and she does yep. the percent max health damage, so she doesn't really care if people are like these percent yep. higher health. I think she's not too bad, honestly. Um, okay. I don't know. She's just kind of squishy. I feel like she loses to Z-tier champions and S-tier champions. Yes. And I think that she loses... T I, I, I think she bleeds a lot of HP early, and she's very combo-dependent. So I'm just going to put her in C. Yeah. Yeah. C, B, maybe. Maybe yeah. B. Uh, Quinn. Terrible. Yeah, I don't know. She's, she's absolutely terrible. Okay. Rakan, terrible. Yeah. There's no pairings yeah. with them. Ramus, absolutely terrible. Yeah. Um. Because it, it's blind, so you like. Yeah, there's okay. no way. Yeah. Uh. Rexai got awful. Mm -hmm. Rel got awful. Um. Renata got awful. Yeah. Renekton. Uh. I, I, he can be scary. I think with the lethality items and his like Bork. I think his right. like uh super bomber build. You know where he like builds Bork and civilians and stuff. And yeah. Like, there's and a lot of things goes, that can go right to one well you. Because, Yep. Yeah, and he gets, like, uh, the, the needle thingy where he gets 30% armor pen, and then all of a sudden he has, like, 95 lethality and 60% armor pen. It's like, okay, well, if I approach this guy, he will just look at me and <laughs> I die. Right, but, right, 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 right. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah, I think he also has some pretty crazy augments that he can get as well. So I'm fine to put him at, like, B? Yeah, yeah. I yeah. Think so as well. Um, okay. Uh, Rengar. I think Rengar can be unique with Ivern. Yes. It's yep. Absolutely terrifying playing against that. It's one yep. of the few things that I felt like, wow, I literally have no counterplay here. I can't win this. Because he's yes. like also burst immune because of his W. Like yep. he can't really be chunked too hard. He's got CC immunity. Mm -hmm. He will one shot you. He doesn't really care about Zonia's with Ivern because you can just jump again. Uh, yep. the, the map, sometimes, some maps are so small that he just like, you spawn to the game and then all of a sudden yes. you got the yes. ultimate it's really in your gross. head. And it's, it's fucking sound effect and it's like, yeah, yep. nice. Well, well done, man. You yep. Got me. Yep. Completely agree. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I, I totally agree. But he, yeah, he he is just with Ivern. I I don't know what else he'd be with. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. Riven. I think Riven is turbo insane. Uh, yep. Only problem is that she has range issues, right? But uh, every second round, you also have flash. You shit on early game. Yep. You have so much haste early game that it doesn't really like matter that you're actually like weak early because you're not really. You have the lethality items, so you eat plants like. Absolutely yes. insane. You have mobility, so you can run to the plants. Like you can engage a fight. Say fuck this shit. I'm going to the next plant, and then your opponents right. feel like shit when the ribbon comes back with a like 500 health shield. And it's like right. okay, uh, right, 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 yeah, okay. 
I, I mean, I agree with everything that you said. I played a lot with Zamudo, uh, and he played Riven quite a lot. Mm -hmm. And it, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of uninteractive comps that she can run. And if the opponents mm -hmm. just don't aren't equally running, you know, Z or him or fucking, yeah. uh, you know, like unique combo comps, then you just win. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Um, okay, Rumble, terrible. Yeah, I can't imagine. Rumble, Rumble's anything. really really bad. Uh, yeah. Rise have not seen uh, it. Yeah, I played him a bit myself. Um, I think there's a lot that can go very right for you uh, because of your mana passive, right? But yeah. I also think that it's really hard to play the early games. I don't think he's too shit early because like, usually he's like mana gated, so he can't really go too crazy on you. But this right. doesn't really exist here. And I, I think it's more so unique because if you have something like an Alistar that CCs people and you just start unloading a spell fucking flurry, then right. it's very hard like, to survive right. that. Uh, and he scales ridiculously ridiculously hard like you get yep. like i wouldn't say you're guaranteed a prismatic augment right but uh, i don't know how many times out of 10 would you say you get prismatics maybe seven or so like eight uh, times uh i don't know the math on it i know there's a there's a yeah. there's a post that shows the math okay i feel like it's relatively high and if you get one of the augments that are like just increases your health or your ap or uh, like one of those it feels like you yeah, just yeah, become yeah, yeah. Pain. Yes. like your w yep. starts hitting for 1.5k like you just w someone it's like boom yep yeah. yeah, I think that's fine. And I don't um, think his R is too terrible in this either, because you can go for plants early game. Yep. Um. I. Uh. Okay. Uh. Samira. Mm. I. I think she can be ridiculously strong early with CC, but late, late into the game, it's kind of underwhelming. She, right? She's pretty bad. Yeah. Like, yeah. Okay. Sejuani, don't. Um. Senna. I haven't played Senna. How many souls does she get? No idea. No clue. Okay, we have to play Senna. Uh, that, we're gonna we're gonna play Senna. Okay, we're gonna so play Senna. When we play. Yes, some. Dude we're gonna play a Senna like, game. There was some weird thing that happened where she got like chauffeur Senna, and yeah. uh, he was like playing an invis champ himself, like Evelyn, I think. And then Senna made herself invis, and then Evelyn made her invis or something. And then all of a sudden, she started auto hitting from like invisible. <laughs> you just start getting vacuum what? cleaned, and you just start dying. <laughs> Okay, okay. All right. Apparently, it's six per round, but uh, I okay. don't know, man. That sounds kind of shit. Six per round sounds really bad. It yeah. does not sound enough. Um, yeah, it does not sound enough. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Seraphine. I think she's one of the best enchanters. Yep. Uh, I think her ult is really, really strong in this. Uh, good early game, good late game. Like, yep. uh, there's lots of stuff where, like, if I play like Asol and someone else plays Senna, and we have, I get a, a, a slowing thing, uh, Rylas, yeah. which is also cancer buffed in this. Yep. Uh, then she stuns instantly, and it's just like, yeah, so hard to right. play against the ground as right. lava. Right. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, set. I don't know. I don't think he's too bad, honestly. Uh, I, I don't like think he's, he's super bad. Good. I think he's very pub stompy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I think he's gonna be bad versus high MMR players. Uh, he does auto lose to a lot of the elite pairings. Yes. Um, so I mean, I'll I'll put him at I'll put him at like B. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'll put yeah. him at like B. Okay, Shaco. He's I he's just fucking Z. <laughs> Z. He's Z. Okay. Yeah. Is he not? I mean, it's it's something between S and Z. I'd say some something between there. You don't think you, really? Wait, why don't why don't you think Shaco is just Z? Uh, I feel like it takes time to set up his like boxes and his entrances and everything. I feel like if you just run to the like plants and you just zone a little bit, then it's kind of yeah. hard for him to just go in and go crazy. Like yeah, his ult is really obnoxious. The firing closing and then he walks at you with a with a clone. It's like oh, right. yeah, yeah, shit. Now <laughs> I feel really right, right, bad right, right. right now. Right. But I okay. feel like that's also uh, very inflated against shit players because they're like, oh True. shit, what am I gonna do? Panic, panic. True. And and there is so much that like like you go juice box on this champion, and then you get a cowboy hat on accident. What? Ah oh, shit! Yeah, you get a cowboy hat if you get juice box or something. Like you just get unlucky and you you get a cowboy hat. Like you okay. know you get the cap of juice, okay? And yeah. then your clone doesn't have a. a, a oh hat okay. Well, why would you buy cap of juice? In case you get a juice hat or just there's just so much like small stuff that like. Wait, makes there's a juice. Like, wait, cap of juice. Wait, what? Well, there's just so much small shit that feels like... Uh, no, wait, wait, wait I, I don't understand. Can cool. Kappa Juice be beneficial? Uh, no, 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 but the juice box, you know? Oh, the, the, oh, uh, oh, augment, oh, like, you juice, if you, if you get that augment. Oh, get, okay, okay, yeah. okay, 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 okay. I think juice oh, are okay. ridiculous in this. Like, 
Okay, but, okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> the contract augment reveals the shackle. Yeah. There's just contract so much augment. Yeah. Like yeah. Okay. Uh, Shannon. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I think. Um, I wonder how he is full AP. Uh, I don't know. That, that sounds like some stinky ass tech dude. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let me, think... let me read his ratios. Let me read his ratios to you. So, he deals bonus magic damage 2% per 100 AP, max health. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, he gets three of them, right? So 6% per 100 AP, okay. Um, 15% bonus health, 16% bonus health, plus 135% AP on his... Or 216% AP on his shield. Yeah, oh, I don't know. What... I wonder... No, there probably isn't. I mean, just play Kale, man. Just play Kale. He's yeah, D, yeah, okay? Yeah. He's just D. I mean, I, I, mean, I think... Uh, well, I mean, his stuff. W beats... Hold on, his W beats yeah. Kale and Kindred. But exactly, exactly. Only, only temporarily. Yeah, but maybe that's enough. Oh, okay. All right, let's put him B. Actually, maybe... Mean, no, you know what? Maybe these ratios make him better than Poppy and Orn. Yeah, I mean... I mean, he just has a role that the other tanks don't fulfill, which is the all right. immunity, right? And right. Uh, taunting. And he's really strong early game. Uh, yep. Yeah. Yeah, he might actually be A. He might be A. Yeah. Um, Shivana, D. What? No way! Every what do you mean? What every do you mean? Round, every round you get five armor and MR. That is insane. And then you go this like the the on hit items are insane. What? The on, uh, no 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 no. Latar has been playing Shivana every single like he's been. We never ever ever got even close to losing as Shivana. She has like one of the highest DPSs in the entire game. He out DPSs my ASL full build queuing a dummy and stuff. Like and and that's with like him buying like anti max health items. She is insane. Insane. Like I, I promise you, she is insane. I pro on God, dude. I, I, I'm willing to sacrifice Jace. This is how how insane she is. That's how. That's how insane. Okay, I'm, where are I'm we putting you. her? But she, there's no way she beats the Zezer or or him. Mm, but she can shit on everything early. She can shit on every mid, and then she gets like at least uh, like three or two. Mm, this, like, uh, this is another one know, that I, you're gonna have to play. You're gonna have to play it for me. Right. I mean, I've never played it. I've only seen. Oh, okay. All right. All right. All right. But no, but I'm saying, I'm, I'm telling you, she's pretty. Okay. Okay. Crazy. Okay. All right. Oh, listen, well, listen, oh. listen, listen, listen. Let me, let me, let me write plan. these down. Hold on. We got Jace. We got Shivana. Okay. And we got Shen. <laughs> and we got Senna. These, these are the tests that we have to. Yeah. 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 Okay. Auto okay. queue on a plant. Auto queue on a plant. What happens when you oh play my Shivana? My fucking god. Okay. 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 The entire plant's gone because of the double. Oh, okay. Okay. Yes. Yeah. I. All right. I get it. I get it. Okay. You're smelling me now. Oh my lord. Okay, singed. I'm smelling you, dude. Ultra I'm strong. Singed. Insanely strong. The dot He's items, you buy two dot items and you're so strong. You got your ult every round. Like, there's not a time where you're not, like, running around with ults. You run to plants insanely quickly. Your passive is good. You got CC. You flip people out of the ring. You got your rooting, which is, like, insane against some champions. It's just crazy. Okay. I agree. Yeah. I yeah. think he's actually... Yeah, I think I, I agree. And obviously, he deals damage, so it's nice. Yeah. Um, like... Scion. I don't know about his passive. I don't. Under, I don't know how his passive works. I just imagine that he's terrible. Yeah, yeah, he is. And uh, you, by passive, I mean him. blood furnace, not not fucking oh. the boss passive. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, I mean, you get yeah. a few. I think. Yeah. Like, uh, uh, Sivir, good. terrible. Mm -hmm. Scarner. I don't know I, how Scarner is. Yeah. I with think he augment. Um, Scarner can also do the thing to Kindred. Um, where you can, you can fucking control it and actually throw her out of her ult. <laughs> yeah. You know how you, like, turn around? Yeah. With course. Skarner and it displaces her yeah, out yeah. of the ultimate? Yeah, you can, yeah. you can do something like that, uh, to Kindred. Um, so, like, <laughs> I think Skarner has some unique combos and he's, like, not yeah, researched I, enough. I think he's very scary. Yeah. He scales really hard as well. Like, also, his spires in... on some maps are bullshit. The winter map? <laughs> yeah, and, like, in the Why middle, is but... his spire in the bush in yeah, the middle? You, yeah. What is going on? Yeah, it's, it's so, scary. like, yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Doesn't make any sense. Um, okay. Uh, Sona. Uh, whew, I don't know. I haven't seen much. I haven't seen her either. Uh, yeah. I imagine she's bad, but I don't know if it's yeah. accurate. Maybe with so much ability haste and, like, heal and shield, she... Yeah. I don't know. I just feel like, why would you want to play Sona when everyone's economy is the exact same? And why not just pick... Like, imagine, would you rather, if you're an ADC player, would you rather have, like, a Sona, or would you rather have... Yeah, and also um, you lose every early round. A Kane. 
You'd yeah. rather have yeah. a king. Yeah. You just yeah. the yeah. for you. You're gonna lose every early round. Yeah. Same, same with Soraka. There's no reason yeah. to have these champs. Um, Swain. Yeah. Every one of these shit tier lists put Swain in yeah. like, oh, he's so good. But my goodness, is he garbage? He's so useless. Like maybe if he gets his perfect augments, he can be like S tier. But I feel like he's just aim. Like yeah, I think he's A. Bad. I think he's A. Like, yep. Uh, yeah. Yep. Yep. You right, like everyone is so the reason that everyone I think that is making these tier lists put Swain yeah. so high. People don't run out of his ult. Yeah, you can just run away. You, you can just run out of his ult. Right. And also on low ping, you can't get hit by a Z. Yeah. It's like not possible to get hit by a Z. Um, yeah. And he can't, like, I mean, he can land W like once or twice with like CC and stuff, but he just gets blasted by so many of the champions above him. Yeah. Um, yeah. Anything that there's no value there. He feels so yeah. badly. Okay. So. I'm gonna say a champion, okay? We're gonna fucking maybe we're we're gonna fucking fucking okay, okay. we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do this, yeah. okay? Uh, oh, <laughs> okay. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna fucking okay. do this. All right. Yeah. All right. All right. Hold on. Let me just fucking let me let me move her up, dude. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Have you seen Syndra? Uh, no. In solo queue, I permaban Syndra because I'm a Vlad one trick, and I just permaban her, and I've got the habit of permabanning her in, in this game mode as well. So okay. I haven't seen a single <laughs> Syndra actually. <laughs> she. So for some reason, Riot decided yep. to give her like I think it's 25 stacks around. I I don't know what that means, but like a lot. So oh, so so when Syndra hits, okay, so so when Syndra hits 100 stacks of her yep. passive, she executes any champion below 15%. When she hits them. Oh, okay. Okay. Does not matter what your HP is. So, <laughs> so, so she, so she executes you. Why does Syndra have like thirteen hundred range with QE yeah, on I mean, one this, second it, cooldown? That is pretty silly. Why does her W deal sixteen hundred true damage? Yeah, it's yeah. <laughs> what is like? And I mean, she dude, can I'm get the, Zanya's. I'm, I'm, I'm the world's biggest Syndra hater, so. I'm, dude, I'm she like... she is she can beat Rost. That's the other like really scary thing is because she she can actually pop Edge of Night. She has mm -hmm. Zanya's. Um, she has a lot of other augments. She completely fucking dicks on a, a, a lot of the champions in S and Z. Yeah. She just has too much range, too much damage early on, too much CC. Like, it's just not balanced. And then the execute, she ruins tanks. She literally punishes yeah, yeah, you yeah. for like thematically trying to beat her. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It doesn't make sense. Does not make sense. It's Mister and Misses. Um. Okay. Okay. Uh, Silas. Pretty bad, I think. I don't know. Yeah. Like I I, he wants the one shot, but you can't one shot because everyone has plus four hundred health. Yes. Fun. Fun. And the starting items gives you. Uh, yeah. Also, beyond awful. I think he's the one. Is, of is the there a build where he can perma stun, Tom? Uh, I don't know. I think the only time he's useful is if he's paired with um something like uh, some ADC that really doesn't want to die or like get hooked or like or some shit like that. But it's just so. Uh, I don't know. I think he's one of the worst champs in the entire game. I wonder if there's an ability haste build and everything where he can perma stun. I wonder if that's a thing. That, then, then he's probably squishy and he gets one shot by everything else. Or, true, uh, true, 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 true. Yeah, I. I don't <sighs> see anything like it's a two v two as well. So. Well, he's amazing. He's an amazing duelist early on, right? Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Put him B. Uh, Talia, okay. have you seen her? Uh, no, not a single one. I haven't seen her either, so I don't know what to think of her. Um. She's really good on a lot of the small maps. I think she's good against Kane, uh, but she yeah, loses to all the poke and range champions. So, like, yeah, even, yeah. I mean, even Syndra and blasts her. So, like, complete. Yeah, uh, I'll put her B. Like, A. Mm -hmm. Yeah, A. Okay. Uh, Talon. <clears throat> uh, I don't think Talon's too bad, honestly, because there's a lot that can go really right for him. Yeah, uh, he's one of the like lethality champions, which is crazy. Like, right. and his early game is insane. It's really right. hard to dodge um, like his W on uh, uh, no boots because in the early round you don't have really boots, right? Yeah. So uh, I don't know. I think he's pretty good, honestly. Like maybe B A. I don't know. It's yeah. not like he scales poorly either because like in a two v two, you just one shot somebody and it's uh, you're, yes. you're chilling. I agree. Okay. Yeah, I agree. I completely agree. And, and there's so many walls, and you can eat, and it resets every round. So yeah, I don't know. I think he's pretty good. Um, I'll put him, I'll put him B, I think, yeah. uh, because I just think, so his damage is obviously really high, uh, yep. but there are matchups where he actually just can't approach, 
yeah, even yeah. if he has Edge of Night. That's, that's um, so I think in that regard, he's still worse than... Like, I still think from seeing her at six items, Nefiri's the best assassin. Yeah, I mean, it's so little... Because she just presses R and then so W. Simple. And yeah, there, so there's... Simple. Yeah, it, it, I mean, she's on top of you. Like, yeah. Uh, Tarek. Oh, Z tier. Yep. Super Z tier. Yep, yep, yep. All right. I don't think we need to really elaborate on that one. Um, yeah. Okay, uh, Timo. Uh, S, maybe Z. I feel like he needs, like, some setup time, but he throws out his shrooms so quickly that's really obnoxious. Uh, yes. He invalidates certain audit comps, like, early into the game. Like, he just completely yep. like, invalidates them entirely. Uh, Ludens yep. has crazy damage as well. Uh, like, there's just so a, lot, a lot going for him. Yeah, he has a lot of really good stall. The one thing I like about him on S is he's so powerful early versus so many comps yeah. that he, yeah. he really actually hits their HP. Yeah. So that's kind of cool. He has combos yeah. that I think are disgusting, like Cassio. Um, yeah. Timo Cassio is like really, really nice. Um, his blind is really valuable versus some ADC comps. Yeah, and um, the plants eating as well. Yeah. Like, yeah. Right, right, right. <laughs> so his, his mushrooms have a lot of good value for like stalling and sieging games versus some champs. So yeah, I mean, yeah. I, think, I think he's S. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Thresh, he's D. Oof, yeah. Uh, Tristana. I haven't really seen, but I can't imagine her doing too much because it's like crit yeah. ADC and it's just. Uh, and she, yeah, she needs her levels, which don't happen until later. Uh, it's painful. Yeah. Uh, Trundle. Only saw it once. I thought it was terrible. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. But yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I thought it was bad. Uh, Trindamir, have you seen him? I think he's the shittest. I think he is the shittest champion in the entire game. What? Really? Single... You think he's the worst? I, don't, I, don't, I legit don't think there's a single worst champion. Dude, you lit me. Okay. Trindamir ghost ults on you. And uh, ghost, uh, flee ults on you. And you press flee as well. You and then he W's you. Anyway, okay, and then you look at him for one millisecond. And... <laughs> like oh, maybe okay, on 180 okay, okay. ping. But... Okay, okay. I don't know. All right. I feel like he just does nothing. Yeah. Uh, okay, Twisted Fate. I don't know, man. It's kind of shit. I think his passive is kind of interesting, but it's it's so low that it's really whatever. Yeah. Uh, I put him D. Uh, Twitch mm -hmm. is unique because he only goes with Casio, I think. Really? I think, think Twitch is one of the best. I, th I think he is uh, really? way better. Really? Think you go yeah. beyond Casio? Dude, you spawn into the game. You well, I, I, you know, person, actually, maybe I'm really no just underestimating his damage. Like, yeah, he, his damage is true insanity, and there's so much that makes him like no counterplay, like scope lens and his with his ult. Like he just hits you from across the map. He will one shot you. He can go on hit. He shreds tanks. He can do whatever he wants. I think he's r like absolutely insane. Like absolutely insanity. Okay. Like he's okay, strong no, early. Yeah, I, I, I think yeah. the logic of like Ezreal Corky, where Twitch also can itemize differently, mm -hmm. is very valuable. I think his stealth is really valuable. Mm -hmm. um, no, it's, it's so yeah, it, Terrain control with W is also really gross. And mm. I think, yeah, what, what you're saying actually makes sense. Maybe I'm just, like, under, I've so only ever damage. played him with Cassio. So maybe that's why I'm just really yeah. thinking he needs Cassio. But yeah, perhaps no, I, I am just like wrong. Um, if you can't get on top of him, it's just so AIDS. Like, it's, yep. He's just so hard to play against. Yep. Okay. Udir, D? Uh, <laughs> what do you think? Uh, do you think no, he has a, got, uh, a heal and shield bill? What, what do you think? Uh, I've got this uh, tech, this uh, Bluetooth Udir tech. I okay. heard about it. Oh, yeah, I heard, I heard yeah. minus 172 LP. What happened? Uh, uh, three Timos in uh, in the lobby. That's what happens. Okay. And I felt okay. really bad. Yeah. But okay, okay. Listen, you get scoped lens stage one, stage two. Yeah. You get ghost crawlers. Oh, okay. okay. So we're just rolling yeah, yeah, augments yeah. like God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just, you okay. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But if you get it, if you get it, then you auto hit from the wall. Like from the wall, the vo the walls have arms and they two shot you. They always two shot you, no matter what health you have, no matter what armor you have, because of a uh, hundred lethality, seventy percent armor pen. But if you get those, or if you get that, or black shield, if you get those two things, I feel like you roll everyone in the entire lobby, straight okay. up, okay. and even even him, even him. You don't roll him. No, dude. I'm telling you. He oh can't even, my this, god! By the time he casts his W, by the time he casts his W, oh. you already go uh, tiger stance, ka -ching, ka -ching, and he's just dead. I'm telling no, you, it is no, it not is, on, no, dude, doesn't roll. He does not roll, Mister and Misses. I think he's 
pretty scary. It's kind of open for line, but I think he can be really, really scary. I'm willing to put my 172 minus LP on okay. the line. Okay, all right. We're writing this down in our fucking Discord chat as well. Ooh, dear. Okay. All right. Okay. All right, all right. Let, let's move. Uh, Ergot, he's terrible. Please tell me I, you agree. Yeah, only, only light him up can make it okay. okay. But this is terrible. Uh, Varus. I think his AP build is okay. He's really strong early. Yes. He's really strong early. Yep. Uh, put yeah, my chat uh, is telling you to read your chat, by the way. Uh, I don't know. What, 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 what happened? What happened? Uh, I don't know. Wait, I, wait, I, I, you, no, I turned Twitch chat off because I had scrims on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I turned Twitch chat off because I had scrims on. Why, why, why? What happened? What happened? I don't know. What the fuck? Wait, let me turn it back on. What, what, what? Chat, chat, chat. What, what, what? Donut wall. What do you mean? Jeez. I have 601 gifted, dude. <laughs> Gee, imagine how that guy feels right now. Oh man! Dude, I had to chat off because I had scrims. Oh man, whatever. Maybe he'll guys! Really, maybe he'll notice me tomorrow. Oh. Guys, I literally had scrims, and then we're making a fucking tier list to cleanse all of the subreddits and YouTube videos that are putting fucking Aurelian Soul and Don't Tier and fucking they don't even mention Kindred. Okay, like Jesus. Oh my god. Oh my. Yo, what's up? No, no, no. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. All right. Oh my god. Thank you, Dreamcatcher, for 601 gifted subs. Oh my god. Holy moly. I didn't even know it. But I didn't know because I had Twitch chat off because I'm making tier lists, focusing purely on this. And then we had scrim, so obviously I turned Twitch chat off. Oh my lord. Let's fucking speed run this. Uh, Vane. Um, oh, I, I don't know. I feel like uh, people can. There's other champs that do better, but I mean, I think uh, there's a lot that she can get that makes her really obnoxious. Like, um, you exit stealth and you become speedy, right? Or and you just run at people at like 700 move speed. Uh, we we okay. We did we we did the vein. Uh, Vigar terrible. Yeah, yeah. I mean, okay. his cage is nasty, but other than that, yeah. Uh, Velkaz. Mm, I think his he he has like insanity range, but everyone has so high health that I don't think he can like hold ult hard to zero people. And right. because it's a two v two, like you always get CC. Like there's no way that you're playing it's a combo, and they both yes. don't have something to stop your ult. Yes, just... yes, yes, yes. And then he's yeah. weak. He's kind of weak early, item dependent. Okay. Yeah, uh, Vex, I think is D. There's no reason to play her. Yeah. There's yeah. Literally yeah, no reason. Sure uh, Vi, please. I think please, Vi please. is pretty crazy. Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah. No. No. Point and click ult. That's nasty. Oh my god. No. Okay. Point and click okay. Ult. Okay. Okay. Park, she she R's scaling. she R's she R's Heimer, and he self R's, and he's in three of his turrets, and then Zanya's. She's dead. Okay. Okay. She okay. tries to R Kane. Kane R's her. Mhm. Mm okay. She mm -hmm. tries to R Syndra. Syndra Q E W R. She's dead. You, you can't uh, R her when she's R'ing, right? Or, what like, do you mean? When she's no, R'ing. she's unstoppable. Well, I mean, you can't stun her, but the damage, because Syndra executes at 15%. Yeah, but a Maw or Anathema's in the late game, like, that probably is enough Syndra, No, Syndra's W will stuff. deal 1,600 true damage. You think? No, it does. Okay. Uh, Unforgiven oh, okay. Unforgiven play, had six items, Syndra did uh, 1,600 true. Okay, 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 okay. Um, it, it's like, I don't... And then also there's like Zanya. I just don't. I don't say. I mean, and uh, also I don't think she's tail, tail kindred tar comps. Huh? I think she's like A or B. I'll give you B. Uh, I mean, the lethality is pretty crazy. In this. Okay. All right, vape nash. Uh, vape nash. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Yeah. Uh, uh, Victor, so terrible. Victor is so bad. Victor really? is so bad. Mm, listen, Come listen. On. You get so, listen, you get so much ability haste that your W, it goes off, it goes on cooldown as soon as you put it down. Not when it disappears. So okay, you can control is, the map okay, so he, well. Alright, he's not, he's not don't. Alright, I am being dishonest here. He's not don't. He's probably, like, yeah. okay, if I'm being totally honest, he's probably like A. I think he's like A. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you also get like twenty five hex bits per round, and because you get so yeah. many kills, you like you get you get augments so unbelievably quickly, uh, and your scaling is pretty well. You, there's a lot that can go right. Dual gauntlet on hit effects. Um, you, you can go like somewhat tanky as well. Victor's base armor is ridiculous. You shit on like certain. You shit on melee champions just in general. You just completely piss on them. Things yeah. that want to engage on you like a cled. You press your W down. You press R down. And you zonias. Cleds like half life, thinking, ah shit, this guy's. Okay. Third hand is up my ass. What can I do? <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, here yeah. it is. Here it is. This is all yeah, you. Yeah, Vladimir. yeah. S, 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 if not Z. F is not Z. Dude, he is ridiculous in this. I don't think I've... I mean, I've lost one round with Ivan Rengar, which was pretty rough. But he is insanity. There is so much that can go slightly in favor of him, and he goes so in sicko mode because of his passive. And because everyone has so high health, listen, yes. everyone's health is, is so unbelievably high, right? So yes. Demonix is good. Your health is unbelievably high, so Demonix is good. Yes. Your passive is really good, so Demonix is good. Demonix yes. makes you insane. You do not have a game where you don't finish it at 1,000 AP. You do not right. need CDR, so you can go full magic pen. Your starting item gives you 65 AP, which is ridiculous. Insanity. Sork shoes give you fifty five percent. Okay, okay, you can. Okay, yes. All right, right, all right. Elite five hundred. Yes, I'm. I'm this, sure we'll see a lot of him when he comes to create. Yeah, I'm, all right, going, I'm going harder. I'm going harder. Right. Vlad beats Kale. Vlad beats Heimer. Vlad beats Ezreal. Uh, Vlad beats Corky. One hundred percent. Any day of the week. Uh, We're gonna unmute him in a second. He's still gonna be talking. Set. Uh, okay. Listen. Uh, yeah, there, there's yeah, yeah, a secret yeah, tech that I do. Uh huh. But wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What do you What do you think about him versus Rust? I think if Rust does, if he goes full lethality, he gets one tapped because you can't hit a Vlad who's in pool and one shots you. Impossible. Impossible. You got probably. he builds like off tank then it's a bit rough but then you're building into a sustained battle and then your duo kind of can shit on him as well mm. it's a it's a 2v2 fist fight and vlad for sure forces him to not go his one shot build so his ult won't kill you got okay that was good. Yeah? That was really good. Z tier. Z. Zlatimer. All right, excellent. Thank you so much. Thank <laughs> you so much. He's S. <laughs> I'll, I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you. Okay, it's fine. All right, Volley Bear. Uh, I don't know. I think it gets outscaled pretty yeah, quick. It's terrible. It's terrible. Warwick. I've never. I think Warwick is also. What? Dude, what? You're going to say he's good? Items. No. No, he is so scary. Listen, I <gasps> thought so too. But I have lost against so many Warwicks. That guy oh. gets crazy. He gets his Axiom arcs. He goes, nom, 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 nom. and all of a sudden you're one health and he hunters zeros you. And it's just, it's just a bad time. I think he's A. Maybe yes. I don't know because he shits on everyone early game as well. And it's really good, like CC okay. in a duel. Like, uh, okay. Think. Okay. Wukong. Nah, that's awful. Okay. Uh, Zaya, terrible. Uh, terrible, terrible, terrible. Yeah, Z uh, Zareth. Uh, I feel Zareth's like he... interesting. Uh, yeah, exactly. Zareth's very just interesting. Very enemy comp dependent. Yes. Like, he's uh, he's very enemy comp dependent. Enemy comp dependent. Yep. 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 Totally agree. Totally agree. Okay. Uh, Zin Zhao, terrible. Olympic. Yeah. Um, Yasuo. Absolutely horrendous. Yep. Yone. Pretty say, suffers from the same issues, but slightly less because just better champion. Yeah, I think it's uh, like C. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, Yorick. <clears throat> I, I, okay, I'm about for slog dogs. Okay, he, I think Yorick is pretty pretty nuts because if he gets to his late game and he gets when he like, gets some six and he has all the skill shot blockers and yeah, Maiden, he, yeah, he, he he starts becoming really yes rough. yes and he has a lot compared. of restriction. Yes, he has yeah, so many things going on. with something, holy moly, he becomes really scary. Yep. 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 Um. Okay. Uh, he does bleed early though, because he has no he has no value early. Yeah. yeah. He bleeds some so HP. Yeah, he will lose. That's four I mean, health. that's just yeah. Okay. Uh, Yumi. You can't play. Okay. Uh, Zach. 
I haven't seen him. Uh, I think he's unique. He has combos. Okay. He absolutely has combos, yeah. Uh, like Nila's Zack. Mm-hmm. Or like Mordekaiser's Zack. Um, I think okay, like okay, those, okay. those type of combos. But like, it, it's so comp dependent, and I don't necessarily think that he's actually that good. Uh, Z- uh Zed. Absolutely busted. Beyond okay. busted. He, like, he is... Yeah, I think in low ping, he's going to be a fucking problem. I think he is 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 Kane tier, unironically, genuinely. I genuinely believe that he's Kane tier because he does what Kane does without even, like, getting himself in danger. Plus, he pokes. Plus, he's good early game. Plus, he has so many things that can go right. War of routine, and it's just over, and he's super strong. He's AD as well. He shits on tanks. The Eclipse is amazing. Like, I don't know how you can play Rast into a Zed who just plays patiently. How, how do you get on top of him? Yeah, well, I mean, you just have to run at him, right? You have to smork. But yeah, then but he, then he, he yeah, one-shots it, it, you. It, it, he W ults? Okay, now you have to, like... Well, you edge of knight. The... You have edge of knight, so okay. you block his yeah, but... first shuriken. Yeah, but you But then w- does he have enough or, damage or, or like... to... No, then he can't kill you, oh. though. No, there's... If he is on you, for sure, dude. And it, it isn't, it is, he's so gated by ability haste, but you have so much ability haste in this. Like, yeah, by the yeah, time yeah, Naked yeah. comes around, you almost got 200. You can triple Q off a shadow. Okay, triple. but Zed auto loses to a lot of champs, though. Like what? Kindred Tark. Yes. He does auto lose. He also auto loses yeah, to Kale. That's true. That's true. Um, I mean, he will also he bleed... Him. Okay, Zed is going to bleed HP early. Like, hit points. You think? I think so, I feel yeah. like Serrated Dirk is so unbelievably OP that he can... Um, okay, what's his combo? What's his like, combo? Early rounds. Like, who he pairs with, or...? Yeah. Like, like, oh. g- give me, give me, like, God tear peering. Like, give me, give me, like, God tear pairing. Like, k- all right, Kindred, all right. So, Kindred Tarek versus Zed, what? There, I don't think there's anything that Zed wins early rounds. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure, I'm not sure what you'd pair it with, but I still feel like right. he's, like, he stumps, like, 95% of the roster, like, very hard. And he can, he can deal with him, he can deal with Mr. and Mrs. He's the anti- He can't deal with Mrs., and- don't you say that. No, he can't. <laughs> <laughs> He cannot oh, deal with I misses. Know. He can't it's deal with misses. Scary. No, dude. Okay, I, okay, dude. Maybe I'll, I'll give you that. I'll give you that. I'll okay. That. The like, there's a few champions that I think can deal with misses, um, mm-hmm. in the game, but like, they're so fucking. They're not real. Like yeah. Zareth is not real. She's not. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, it's just. Uh, or like, he's not. He's it. not real. Like, yeah, what else is yeah, there? Never see there's it. um, yeah. Ezreal can deal with misses. AP Cog, I guess that that's real. AP Cog can deal with misses. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, Gwen can deal with misses because he she can actually mm-hmm. get onto her. Like, yeah. yeah. Um. Yeah. Okay. Uh. All right. We're almost done. Uh. Zeri. Terrible. Okay. I have not seen single Zeri, but like, what's she gonna I, do? I don't know. On on uber low ping, I don't know what happens with some of the combos, but uh, yeah. I feel like um, um, Ziggs. Like, yeah. Well, maybe we're being dishonest with the D tier. Maybe she's like uh, I don't know C or she's something. She's not D. Right? Like, but, yeah. Uh, Ziggs. Terrible. Really. You think it's good? Unforgiven. Like he... Unforgiven thinks the champion's nuts. Okay, well maybe, maybe I've not seen him okay, so, at all. I think. Yeah. So he beats I, I guess... all of the turtle comps. Yeah. Um, he does beat all the turtle comps. He can beat misses. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, that's he true. is very strong early because he can control all of the plants yeah, with like nice. satchel charge and minefield. Okay, okay, okay. Um. He can beat Kindred Targ early, beat Kale comps early, etc. So he can do some damage to them hit point wise. I agree. Um, he does. He does get outscaled though. I think. I'd I'd put him in A. Yeah, I, I'll give you that. I um, I was wrong with. Okay. Being, saying terrible for sure. Okay. Uh, Zillion. I saw you were playing him. I think Zillion is uh uber strong, absolute okay. insanity strong. If you get a little bit lucky and you get with haste, you win the game instantly because nothing can touch you anymore. Like, literally, you, you have 1,100 move speed, basically. So you're just yeah. down this zooming around. You can yeah. double stun. You can double bomb, double bomb stun. Infinitely. Right. Literally yeah, infinitely. Also... Yeah. And the ult can is ridiculous. protect his ally. Yeah. 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 And there's the secret sauce. I'm going I'm to say it right now, okay? Navary? You go Serrated Dirk Zillion. Serrated oh. Dirk Zillion. Or whatever, Guardian's Dirk, whatever the fuck. Okay. And you... Ult yourself, and then you start munching on plants, and then you have another ult. You outlast every champion in the fire ring. If it comes down to it, you just you're just immortal in the fire ring because you can just munch on plants all day. Okay. What the fuck? Okay. 
Yes. Okay. Yeah. Because right. it's like uh, all right. you I let you cook. I let you cook. Cool down, and, and then it, uh, the sound effect is zoom, and then he dies, and then it takes like ten years for the guy to respawn again. You run yep. to another plant, you start eating it. So, yeah. 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 Uh. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Joey. I don't know. I think she's so underwhelming. Yeah, like, I think uh, she's pretty bad too. Yeah. I mean, she does have bubble though, so it's like yeah, it's yeah. pretty obnoxious. With high enough That's ability, haste, she can actually just she's you know she's splooging everywhere, dude. She's going for the world record. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Zyra. Super strong. Yep. Insane I think Zyra. Zone yeah, insane zone control, really strong early. Insane mm -hmm. augments. Mm -hmm. Beats a lot of themes. Can yep. depend. Yep. She can actually beat Mister. Like if she lands the root. Oh yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. So and then her plants act as like a way to stop him from smorking. So like, pretty mm -hmm. good. But she does auto yep. auto lose auto fucking lose to Ezreal and Syndra. So oh yeah, I can definitely imagine. Yeah. So I I mean it. She's definitely good. She's up there. Absolutely Z. And that is it. Mm -hmm. That is uh that that's the tier list. And Nefiri, Nefiri, but it's not here. No, uh, she's not here. She's because uh this rips from Riot's API, so it's not on live server mm -hmm. yet. Yeah. Um, Where I would. Better? So here's the thing about Nefiri. Yeah. She is the worst champion in the game. One, two, three items she can actually start to win, depending on who her, her who her combo is, right? Yeah. Um, when she gets to six items, I actually yeah. don't know what someone does. Yeah. She just presses <laughs> W. Point and click. Yeah. You have to, yeah, you have, you have to, you have to immediately Zanya's or use an ability <laughs> or something, but you can't dodge it. She just points and clicks. Yeah, it's, it's so silly. So, I, I don't know. Do you think she's better than Zed when she gets six items? Uh, I, I don't think so. No, no, there's no okay. way. Yeah. So I think she's probably at six items. If you can survive everything, then she's probably yes. Yeah. Yeah. But that's yeah, but, but that's but that puts her on A, right? Because she's probably yeah. Gave so it, I think we'd, we'd balance it out to A. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Amazing. Well you done. Well done. <laughs> Lovely. All right. Wait. Do you want to play some PBE before Juju thing?